There we go. Hello, oh, everybody. Hello, everybody. <laughs> why, are you, why is this a thing now? My I name started is a thing. Op- yeah. <laughs> My name is We're taking op- over. <laughs> My name is Offbeat Outlaw, and welcome back to 7C6 Idiots. These are the lovely six idiots, myself included. We have Liz playing Helena, the light domain cleric. Marcus Territory playing Dorg Seaswell, the half-orc paladin. Caroline Smash as Bunny, the gnome druid bard, uh, who is currently on vocal rest right now due to the fact that she is a voice actor, and it's not worth her losing her livelihood over stream. Yes. Okay. So Liz will be will be will be reading the lines. Uh, we'll be reading stuff for for Caroline. We have Mash Buds and playing Piggly, the barbarian, ah. who is very close. <laughs> <laughs> Who's just doing his best. And we, Always. <laughs> and we have Valid Boy playing the one and only sorcerer, Helmsworth Free. Isn't that great? And I'm going to be drinking some uh, water out of a green bottle. But I'm yep. Perrier, huh? Yeah, it's Perrier. Shut up. Any- <laughs> <laughs> anyway, when we last left off the party, they were currently entering combat. Combat with who? Combat with none other than a god of battle. And it seems as though one of our party members has forgotten their dice. It's okay. (laughs) It's okay. It's not like it's the only thing you need to play Dungeons. Yeah, I'm sorry. (laughs) It's okay. I'm I'm, I'm grabbing my dice too, because I also forgot. (laughs) (gasps) Can we all grab our dice? Oh my god, guys. (laughs) No, I I just didn't. I realized I didn't have my phone on me. That's okay. That's okay. Um, but today you are there facing off against none other than the avatar of combat who looks something like this. I drew him. See, he looks kind of like a ripoff of, uh, Ares from DC comics. It's just purely coincidence. That's actually not a joke. I, I didn't realize, but he wields a big <laughs> pointy spear slashy stabby thingy and he's a big Resistance sword and he's 15 feet living tall. Living is purely coincidental. Exactly. And he's a giant, and he's got a lot of health, and he is very, very angry because he doesn't want to lose against a bunch of hoodlum miscreants like you all. I don't know what you're talking about. And if we oh, remember, what is that supposed to mean? Uh, it means you're a hoodlum miscreant. Hoodlum. <laughs> I, believe, I believe that was explicit in the language. I didn't realize it was implicit. I'll... <laughs> I believe a hoodlum is one who causes trouble, and miscreant is also Okay, bad. I'm sorry. Look at us. Does it look like we cause trouble? Uh, <laughs> I hope so. What if he's wearing a cowboy hat indoors with sunglasses? Wait, if you know, that's in, not... aren't coliseums, like, open? Oh. Is there a dome over this? (laughs) Anyway. That's a valid point. (laughs) We have, first in the combat order, we have Dorg. Next we have Piggly. Then we have the Knight. Then we have Helena. Then we have Bunny. Then we have Helmsworth. Because if you remember the last stream, we rolled initiative before we went and left. And went on with our weeks. So, everybody. I would like for you all to begin combat as the Knight takes his first step. And, and and you all walk into the Colosseum. Where did you guys want to set up um, in this 100-foot circle? You can move up to as close as the center line. Wait, has combat not started yet? Uh, I'm going to allow you to do this because I skipped over that part right now. The last time. Oh, so. okay. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, I'm going to ask, can anyone create some water for me? Uh, is this before combat starts? Do we have all our actions? You have... I'm going, you have, you. this will be like one thing that you can do before combat. This will be your one action. I'm giving you guys one quick action before we'll actually start. Oh, come on, you, you, right. you, come on, man. Mm-hmm. Let me have it. Let you me do it. it. You push Let me push do it. Right. Let me Elmsworth, do it. God damn. I'm, I'm, do, I'm doing you a solid here. Create water. Can I, can I do like a fun dance to distract the knight? That might Ooh, not do yeah, anything, yeah. but you can try. But, oh, no, 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 but he'll be like, oh my God, who's that really pretty girl? Wow. Helms work, I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna let, I'm gonna let you do it. I'm gonna let you know right now that this is a as much as you can, tall as giant you can man, make. But okay, as but I am a five foot ten, really pretty human woman. Do as you please. Right. Roll performance. I, 
Heck yeah, my favorite one. <laughs> Cash create water next to Helmsworth, 10 gallons. Nice. Cool. Please, 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 Afi, please let me make it. Let me make it, please. I haven't gotten the chance to use it once. Yes, hell it up. Natural 20. Oh, <laughs> but so it, is, it is minus one. So minus it's one. Oh, it's nice. <laughs> so we learn a fun thing about the way I DM. Natural twenties are not auto successes. Nat twenties are not auto successes. <laughs> it just means the best possible outcome. Minus one. Minus one, and he looks to you, and he's clearly like, cute. Okay, but, but what if Bunny sings back up for me? Help action. You, Bunny, that's just you advantage. Do? You already got a yeah, natural yeah, yeah. 20. I mean, no, but, 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 but Bunny, Bunny's like, ah! And it works out great. Roll again if you wish. <laughs> With advantage? Yeah, like, do, yeah, sure. Go for it. Oh, thank God. <laughs> 11. <laughs> this is surprisingly less cute than when you were just dancing alone. Um, and he's actually quite uh, distressed now. Um, and is thinking about killing So we first. scared him. We scared him. Uh, if that's to your be narrative. fair, we insulted him before it beforehand. Oh my uh, God, that's well, I mean, right. you insulted him. You insulted him in his general direction, anyway. <laughs> Helmsworth, he, he because knows. you were so nice, I'm going to allow you. T is this the? Is this the? Is this the thing I'm thinking of? It is. Okay, you get three turns done quickly to quickly make your thingy. Okay. Yes. You have okay. two more turns before this is done. Okay. Okay. What are you up to? You look over you at Helmsworth see? and yeah. notice that he is constructing what seems to be some kind of uh, mounted turret thingy. It seems to be halfway through its process. Oh, I'm liking Another the look of that. <laughs> um, all right. Wait, how many turns did it take to make this thing again? I five. think it said it takes five takes. Okay, turns. yeah, it takes five to make it and then another one to fire it. Yeah, so you're halfway done. Okay. All right, Dork, where would you like to start in this 100 oh, right. in this 100 foot circle? You can move up to as close as the as the center line. It seems as though he is not wavering from his point. Uh a, he's, he's just staying in like the center position uh between the 25. He's just staying at the 25 foot line from the back end. All right. Piggly, uh start up with me. Out in front. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. I think last time we had to protect we had to protect the small people, right? Oh, of course. Sorry, Elena, but also you're small. Do you know how tall I am? I heard you were D five eight. One zero. I swear to the Lord <laughs> above, Marcus. <laughs> <laughs> I think I think so much this annoys you. I, I think I'm gonna last, show you my I, license after this. I think last time we decided I was gonna like be on Dorg's shoulders or something, right? Yes, you got you were yeah, on yeah. Dorg's shoulders because we decided that you can mount you can mount him because he's a size larger. All right, Piggly's. All right, I guess Piggly and I. Piggly mounts up on my back. I'm gonna stand straight on the 50, 50 meter mark. 50 All right, at the fifty mark. foot mark, and football. now it is your turn. What would you like Let's to do? Uh, you have movement, right, action, off. and bonus action. Okay, first off, I'm casting, I'm using my bonus action, cast Shield of Faith on myself. Also, Marcus, check your Zoom settings for your microphone. I was just going to bring that up. It sounds like you're going through your webcam. Yes. Yep, I was. <laughs> <laughs> look at that, look at that crisp much boy. Better. That, oh, that's so Ooh. much better. You Ooh. sound so much crispier. Ooh. <laughs> Crispy. Okay. Uh, yeah, Feel, shield of faith on myself, give myself 22 AC, because I think this guy's going to hit like a truck. And then I'm going to hit him like a truck. I charge straight at him and swing my Vorpal Greatsword. All righty. Roll to hit. Rolling to hit. That is a, I'm going to add my D4 inspiration. Uh, how's a 20? Dirty 20. Dirty 20? Uh, mm -hmm. Dirty 20 hits. Roll All damage. Right. Rolling damage. Uh, what the hell? I'm going to hit him with a second level smite, too. What does so, a Vorpal Sword do again? If he crits, um, he gets to lop off a limb. If it can't be lopped off, it does extra damage. Oh, huh. yeah, I forgot. Because it's Vorpal Sword, it's 23, actually. Oh, yeah, that hits still. Yeah, okay. Um, right. Yes, what's this? I only know how to do <laughs> 
I only know how to do smites now on crits because that's what I mostly use it. Yeah. Um, you can just, uh, so what? You're using a second level smite, so that's a third level. That's uh, that's three d eights. Three d eights. Okay, so that's d twelve. One d twelve plus four, or one d twelve plus seven because of warple, um, plus three d eights. So. To roll that, roll that to start. That is a two, so I'm going to re-roll that. Yes, much better. Seventeen base damage plus three d eights. Ooh, nice. That's thirty-five damage. Thirty-five damage, real crispy. So oh, you it's charge dead. at him. You charge at him with your with your great sword chunk right into the side of his limb past his great sword uh your sword digs into his shield and it cuts into his into his lower into his exposed legs um and you add on the extra might of the ocean behind it dealing a, a nice meaty chunk of damage um nice uh you have another attack i do don't i <laughs> all right I'm rolling a hit again. Mm -hmm. Natural 20! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so uh, I gave up the Vorpal Sword, not expecting to crit. Um, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, burning so that you, second level smite. Uh, you can't, you can't, uh, it, you can't decapitate or dismember this creature. Okay, okay, then I guess. Uh, but you do do the extra damage that the Vorpal Sword allows. Okay, so that's uh, just plus three. No, it's it's a lot more. It's, <laughs> it's a lot more. I've actually Hold never on. seen this before. So. So when in a, when you attack a creature that has at least one head with this weapon and roll a twenty on the attack roll, so that's a that's a crit, you cut off one of the creature's heads. The creature dies if it can't survive without the lost head. A creature immune to this effect if it is immune to slash if it is immune to slashing damage doesn't have a head, doesn't need a head, has legendary actions, or the GM just decides it. Such <laughs> creature will instead take six d eight slashing extra damage. Ooh, well done. Yeah. Um, and that is going to be applied after the critical hit. Okay, so if I remember, three d twelve, and if you're applying a sm what level smite are you applying? Second. Th uh, plus sixty eight. Okay, three d twelve, sixty eight. And then after the crit, um, that is going to be an extra sixty eight as well. Okay. Okay. So the smite and the d8 was going to be 42 damage, and then six d8s more is going to be. Oof, that could have been better. 13. So how much total? Uh, 55. I'm a mamma mia. That's a. That's a lot of damage. Mia. I rolled four ones though. on that 68, by the way. So, four ones. Okay, that's lucky. So you take, for me, you take the great sword, <laughs> and as you, and you just wide back again, and you, you just, you just skirt a little bit to the left, and you see that his calves are entirely exposed. As you look in this nifty little drawing that I drew, see, see, look, guys, you, you see that? Those so are some good. bare calves. That's so good. Thank Those you. Those are chunky calves. So you just, you just, you just dig right into the back of his calf, and just with all of your strength, <sighs> with the serrated edge, it digs straight into it. Um, he's got some thick thighs, though. He's got some thick ass calves, though, so it doesn't lop it off. But oh boy, with that extra strength, you can you though there's blood oozing from that leg. He is that did a lot of damage. He is he didn't he didn't think you all were a threat, but uh but his opinion has changed. Um however Oh, I'ma carve him up like a Christmas ham. Uh you still have your bonus action. Uh no, I use Shield of Faith. Oh, correct. Uh well now he is going to use um a legendary action actually because oh he's, fuck he's getting a little bit spooky so <clears throat> he's going to uh place his shields down in front of him and he is going to just do a quick shove at you 
Uh, make a uh, make a strength saving throw, please. Okay. Hey, Alfie, can I ask a question? Yeah, go for it. What's a legendary action? A legendary action is an action that <laughs> monsters Boy. and other boss creatures can usually can take that can occur outside of their usual turn order. Whether that be on someone else's turn, as a reaction, whenever they want, at the top of the turn order, this creature can take a certain number of legendary actions per round. It has okay. used up one of them that it can take this round. Cool, thank you. No problem. Sorry, that was a dumb question. No, it's no. not usually it's three question. legendary actions and they get replenished after every turn order repeats. Yes. They get. It, oh, God. It's basically a way to balance one figure against like a party of individuals. Yeah, so if you're, I'm... if it would be six v six, that six actions would be six actions, but it's giving one being more actions to make it fair. Yeah. yeah. Right. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, guys. This is gonna be wild. Okay. Uh, eighteen on the saving throw. You fail. <laughs> Shit. You are you, the shield. Wait, 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 wait. Hold oh. On. I... <laughs> Is, I it can time, actually... is it tides of chaos? Is What's this... he trying to do? Can I help since I'm there? Well, I mean, I can bend luck. It's so, a strength saving unless you... throw. And Piggly, you're going yeah. to make a you're going to make a dexterity saving throw to be either you can either dismount and stay where you're at, or you're going to be flying with them and you'll have to make a dexterity saving throw to stay on them. What do you want to do? Either way, dismount say. and stay where I'm at. <laughs> okay, dexterity saving throw. Plus three, Piggly. You get to add plus four to that saving throw. I do? Okay, uh, mm -hmm. that's a 22 then. So I get to add plus seven. <laughs> you make the save, works? but you're still going to be taken. So you don't get shoved back um, the 50 feet, but you feel like you are about to get sent flying. <laughs> um, however, um, this creature, but as this creature shield bashes you, um, you're also going to be taking half of this damage. You feel... Um, you feel your you 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 feel this overwhelming sense of dread accumulate over you. Um, there would have been additional effects if this had succeeded, but it didn't. Um, but you are going to be taking some nifty nifty psychic damage, so that's fun. How much? Um, some. <laughs> that doesn't sound very specific. You're gonna be. I'm scared. No. Hey, it, it, it could be worse. It could be worse. You could have failed the save. You could have failed it. You'll be taking all. You would have been taking all of this. But um, you I guess seven. Seven damage. That's I'm very very optimistic. So you're you take thirteen, <clears throat> twenty four, oh, thirty one. It's more than seven. <laughs> Half of Plus. fifty psychic damage. Jesus Christ. Twenty five. Hmm? Remember, you do have the 11 temp HP if yeah. you didn't put it on from last time. Mm -hmm. I do have that, and it helps a bit. Yeah. <laughs> and I. Oh wait, do we still have aid? Or yes, you guys still have aid. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Because then that's an extra five. That is his legendary action for this turn. <laughs> okay. I, I mean, my turn's done. <laughs> yeah, Piggly, your turn. Right. So I'm still right there. Mm -hmm. Correct. Does this? You, is you it wearing pants? Hmm? Is it wearing pants? It's wearing a sort of skirt, like a like a kilt. So, so it has a belt? Yeah. <laughs> hey, Piggly, pants him. <laughs> <laughs> Close. I would like to uh, climb up the back, uh, stick the rod in the back of the belt, and then activate it. And due to my uh, bestial soul, I do not have to make ability checks when climbing difficult sur surfaces. Okay. Including upside down on the <laughs> ceiling. Just okay. to the back of a god's <laughs> legs count as difficult <laughs> surfaces. I don't know. Okay. That's up to the DM. Um, I feel like, I feel like that, I feel also, like I'm writing that down in the quote surface. book. <laughs> All right. Um... As a reaction, this thing's gonna try and bap you off. <laughs> um, but I'm gonna if this doesn't work, I'm gonna allow you to do that if you like. Okay. It not one. Okay, yeah, you. Can... <laughs> yeah, he misses. He hurts himself in confusion. <laughs> <laughs> no, you guys are doing. Just he just hits fine. the open gash on his leg. Ah! Ah! Damn it! <laughs> ah! <laughs> 
as you're climbing, you use the you use the lopped off part of his calf as leverage to get up, and you manage to get into the belt and stick in the <laughs> movable rod as your as your bonus action. However, that is where you will stay for all of your movement action and bonus action to activate the rod. Okay. But yeah, there you go. Back up, spellcasters. He can't get to you. <laughs> Um, the knight is going really to, clever. uh, the knight's going to look down at Dork, who kind of just humiliated him with a massive sword, and then to Piggly, who humiliated him again, <laughs> um, by sticking- You can't a, see me, I'm behind him. <laughs> by, by, by just hanging around. So, um, <laughs> it, he's going to- So, as, uh, he's going to activate this flaming sphere that sits- in his between his skull. This is an ornamental. This that thing does a use. Um oh, fun. And, oh chaos roll. Okay. Oh god. <laughs> One, two, three. <laughs> oh, I'll come along with you. Scramble initiative, he never gets to go. <laughs> Four. Five. Five. Six. We've even gotten scramble initiative. It's been oh, three times more than now, we right? should have. More than oh, we should Jesus. have. Like more, more than the uh, more than statistics says we more should. More than statistically, Seven. yeah. Seven rolls. Okay. That was that's a lot. That's a lot. Oh, Dugood has eight. Eight. Dugood has oh, eight. Okay. okay. Dugood has eight. Then that's one to thirty-five activation. Oh me! Oh my! Half an hour into the stream, guys. Wait. What? Fifty-four didn't activate. Ah. <laughs> I was almost excited to see that one. Uh, but uh, the, the the beast does activate the flame uh, above its head. Um, the, the, the fiery orb coats his entire or armor in this burning white hot uh, in these burning white hot flames. Um, everybody within 10 feet must now make a constitution saving throw. Or be combusted. All right, Piggly plus three. You said he had he he has flames on him. Yes. I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna use my my inspiration. I got a twenty six. Twenty six. Oh boy, I got a sixteen. All right, Piggly, you managed to. Uh, you managed to 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 uh, take some of this flame and, and and hold on. It still hurts like hell, but uh, you managed to be mostly fine. Uh, Dorg, you're not so much. Uh, good luck. Uh, the flames as they as as they as they broach around you, it feels like it feels like a wave of unbearable heat. It's like Arizona in the middle of the <laughs> summer without AC. Um, it's a dry heat. It's a dry heat. <laughs> it's a dry heat. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm missing. I'm missing a dice. Where is that? Okay, here it is. Okay, there we go. That's more like it. Thirty-three fire damage. Piggly, you take half that. That could have been worse. You round down. Uh, round down. Yes. Okay. Um. And with that, that is his action for his bonus action. He's going to shake his booty to get you off of him. Uh, Wait, Piggly. oh, is it his turn? It, yeah, that, that was his turn. Yes. Oh, okay. I thought that was a legendary action. Uh, no, no, no. Uh, Piggly, uh, please take, uh, please make an athletics, uh, please make a strength saving throw for me. Do I still have plus three? Yep. You're yep. within uh, 10 feet of me. I'm going to use luck. By the way, Marcus, as you failed that strength save, uh, that Constitution save, you are you now have one point of exhaustion until uh, until your next turn. What does that mean? Ooh, exhaustion. We haven't touched. I got a twenty-eight. Long. By the way. All right, you 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 hang on like a little monkey. Uh, uh, exhaustion. Like a little pig. Five E. So here is exhaustion. Uh, exhaustion. Do, 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 do. There are six points of exhaustion that you can take. Uh, exhaustion is measured in six levels. An effect can give a creature one or more levels of exhaustion, as specified in the effects description. At your first level of exhaustion, you have disadvantage on ability checks. So, that's like athletics checks, skill checks of any kind, not attacking rules. 
Okay. But and that will happen to your next turn where you'll be forced to make the save again. Hopefully you succeed. Um, yeah. all right. I'd That's... for sure back up on your next turn though. <laughs> yeah. Um Helena, your turn. Hey. Um How is everyone something. doing? Um I'm I on fire a... and also exhausted, so that's where we're I at. I mean, you're already super hot. Don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, how are you doing health-wise, though? Are you still good? Uh, Not doing too good. Okay, Wait, but like... noted. I'm um... at 18 health. Okay. That's oh, oh, <laughs> that's, oh my. That was that's low. Um, okay. <laughs> I'm gonna, I, do I risk yet? Um, hmm. How far away is Doric from me? Where did you start this combat? I don't know. Where would you like to start this combat oh retroactively? Um, I uh, close enough to Dorg. <laughs> so like uh, 30 feet away. Okay, you start at the say. center and then you can get there yeah. within 25 feet. Yeah. Okay. Um okay. Cool. Um and Piggly, you're still on him? Yeah, I'm on his butt. Okay, I can't do what I want to do. That's fine. Um Please don't fireball me. <laughs> I'm not going to fireball. I was going to do something else. Um, but it's fine. Um, I am going to... You know what? Okay, hold on. I'm going to read the spell. If I did Guiding Bolt, would it just hit this dude and not Piggly? I yeah. believe so. It's not like it. You'd only hit me with like an AOE effect. You had like a if it was like a cone or like an AOE like fireball, then you would hit Piggly. But if it's like guiding bolt and you're making if it's yeah, rolls... if it's just like a single person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. Um, I'm gonna cast guiding bolt. All right, roll or attempt to rather. Roll to hit. Well, you will cast it, but whether or not you hit is a different story. Natural twenty. Okay, we're, it looks like we're all rolling crits today. Yes. <laughs> uh, what what level spell were you casting that one at? I'm casting at a second level. No. What? 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 It's, oh, what's, I thought you were. Oh, going you're on? Never mind. Never mind. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm casting at a second level. <laughs> were, th was that decided? Were you going to cast at second level before or after you found out it was? I a my head went second level. Wait, is he gonna counter spell? Oh no verbal outcry okay oh. okay okay i was confused okay but yes i did sec say second level yeah. second level okay or higher that okay so this will be because you crit 10 d6 radiant damage could kill him i'm gonna okay <laughs> an average of 30 damage oh well, i'm above average so guiding bolt um okay oh my mom texted me um, 10 d6? Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> How many do I have? Not that many. Um, okay. Wait, 5, 5, 3, plus 16, plus 2, plus 2, plus 4, plus 4, plus 2. And this is how many? So this is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Two, four, six, eight, nine. So I need one more. Uh, 32. 32? Nice. Mm -hmm. And as a bonus action, mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna... I'm gonna look at Dorg and I'm gonna cast Mass Healing Word. Ooh, I don't think you can do that. It's a bonus action. But it's a leveled spell. Yeah. You can't cast... Oh, I can't... Oh. You can only cast, like, what, a cantrip now? A cantrip, yep. Yeah. Oh. 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 If you had oh. action surge, you could do that, but not not like this. Um. Okay, then I'm just gonna... Finger guns, and then my turn. Okay. Uh, <laughs> it is now Knight's turn again. Oh, no. Oh, Jesus. Um, it, and again? Uh, with legendary actions, it is his turn. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, he is now going like to... rolled initiative uh, twice? <laughs> <laughs> that would be a lot. Uh, but as his legendary action, he is going to swing his mighty spear at Dorg. <laughs> All right. I didn't mean to laugh, I'm sorry. <laughs> you really should have let him push you away. <laughs> uh, 
that is uh, 25 to hit. Ah, fuck. Uh, did you like, did you enjoy life? Did you have a good one? I never die! <laughs> Let's hope. What is dead um, may never die? That is going I mean, to... you, you got like what? You got that, uh, what's it called? Your thing that lets you survive with one. I do. That that's is that's 23 on. slashing damage. Yep, I'm down, but I have my relentless endurance, which reduces me to one health. Okay. So Neo. this massive knight with one great slash with this polearm thing uh, guts you straight in the side, all b bending in past your, your plate armor. And you feel it. You feel the light draining out of your eyes, but not today. Not today, motherfucker. You grit your teeth, you bear through the pain, and you maintain focus through sheer force of will. And you are at oh one HP. Uh, alrighty. Bunny, your turn. Uh, Alright, Bunny, do an interpretive dance. <laughs> okay, so... Oh, let, wait, Liz, you wanted to voice act for it. Yeah, sure, I'll do Go it. For One it. second. Um, okay, so, I'm Bunny. Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, okay. Oh, you're texting me. Cool, okay. Okay. Um, no, that's my mom. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna run up to where Helena is. Okay. So you I can't run up, sustain the high voice. I'm sorry. You run up and to this. You run up to this. You run up to the second level spot, and you you run up to the to the fifty foot spot, and you cast Binus on the knight. Alrighty, what what save is this? <clears throat> what is your spell save DC? As well, while while we're there. What actually is the spell that we are referring to as blindness? Blindness. 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 <laughs> deafness, deafness slash blindness. Yeah, I blindness, deafness. That would be very helpful if he could not save for this. So he doesn't, you know, slap me 14. around like a chicken. Four. Spell save is 14 for blindness. Okay. Oh um, <laughs> constitution saving throw. He is going to make that. Yeah, he did. What do I, what do, what He's do I a do? very <laughs> big boy. You cast blindness, try, attempting to blast and in, in it blast this this beam of light from your sitar right into his eyes. <laughs> Bunny cries a little apparently as the light, <laughs> as he just pins to, turns down his visor, his helmet blocking most of the blindingness. Okie dokie. Uh, it is now. Helmsworth's turn. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, wait, oh, so, my apologies, my apologies. On Helms. Bardic Inspiration on Helmsworth has been cast. <laughs> and Bunny, no noting that the blindness did not work, turns to Helmsworth, the last person in turn order. Da -da -da -da. Uh, an epic tune plays. Um, Bunny sings a little bit, I guess. Uh <laughs> ah, is that okay? Beautiful. Excellent. Thank you. Um, I know I am. <laughs> Helmsworth, that it is now your turn. What are you doing? <laughs> All right, uh, it's it's quipping time, so I'm gonna I'm gonna look at Dorg. I'm gonna point it at him. I'm gonna say, "Hey, Dorg, you need to pick up the pace a little bit," and then I'm gonna cast haste on him. All right. Love you. Uh, okay. Nice. So uh, now he has an extra two AC and uh, the extra attack action. If you could oh, please say that in a sonic voice, I would appreciate that. Ha! It's time to pick up the pace, Dorg. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, my that dude. That's so good. <laughs> by, Thanks, the way, dude. <laughs> by the way, <laughs> by the way, everyone, chaos timer is ready. Um, uh, but um, uh, but uh, um, I'm gonna, oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna quicken that so that I can still mm -hmm. work on my own thing. Does your do. does your tides of chaos activate? Uh, I have it clicked. I have it clicked. So I think that means that it is in effect right now. So you're while okay. I, I forgot to get my player's handbook right. Oh my god! Thank God, my Leon hands pool is full. Yes. I do. I believe I roll the dice on on wild magic search. Huh? Don't I roll the dice on um, wild magic search? I don't I know. I just want to know what you what you get. Oh, fair enough. Yeah, roll it. Uh, let's see. What's this one? Seventy three. 
A random creature within 60 feet of you becomes poisoned for 1d4 hours. Uh oh. Oh shit. <laughs> there are six creatures. Technically, that, that's, that's everybody. How that's far literally back everybody. Did you start? <laughs> Statistically, we're I in started, trouble. <laughs> I started close enough that I'd be able to use my, my thing. All right, that's going to include everybody. Does this include yourself? Um, it says a random creature. I'm, a, I'm also a random creature. It doesn't say excluding myself, okay. so... Um, <laughs> yourself! Oh, boy. Are you you can't be serious. I am not kidding. <laughs> Time to roll the d4 and see how long you're Are you, for. That's Are you very fucking unlucky. kidding me, dude? I'm not. I rolled a d6, and I rolled a three. Okay, well, I, well, I rolled a one for the... I'm poisoned for an hour. Okay. Uh, Valid, did the spell point? say in front of you? No, it just said within 60 feet of me in general. Oh, okay, okay. Sorry. Yeah. So, yeah. So, like, yeah. That's, that's yeah, yeah. like the entire field. So that's like a 60-foot radius. But he poisoned himself, so, like, eh, if it hit the... What does poisoning even do? I haven't, I haven't had someone... I believe it just gives you disadvantage. On, yeah, it gives you a, a disadvantage on attack rolls and ability checks. <laughs> Sucks to suck, bro. Um, okay. Uh, that is at, at the end of the turn order. It is now time. I cast, I just cast, I just, I just reach out and it's like, yeah, and then I'm like, <coughs> <laughs> your lung gives out. <laughs> uh, with that being said, it is now time for this bad boy's final legendary action for the turn. Uh, he is going to look at Dorg on his, on his last legs and he's going to decide that Dorg maybe eats. He's got to do something about this immovable rod that's shoved down his face. <laughs> um, so, uh, Piggly, he's gonna try and whack at you with his with his. He's he's going to try and whack at you with his with his lance. This this is an attack. Yes. Okay, uh, I'm using my tail reaction to roll a d8 and boost my AC. Um. Okay. This is a twenty-five to hit. Yay. Oh, jeez. Ah, uh, 23. Alrighty. He whacks you really hard with the lance. Uh, wait, I wouldn't be... Oh, wait, no, I already used my reaction this round. Yeah, you did. Sorry, homie. Uh, do, 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 do. That is a delightful 46 uh, slashing damage. Mm. So 23? Yes. As this lance cuts right through you. Um, and you are and you are now have to make an athletics check with disadvantage to stay on the to stay on his back. Oh boy. Rolled a 16 and a 19, so 25. 25? Okay. So you managed to stay on the... You managed to stay on him, uh, despite uh, the fact that you've just been lanced. Could you just roleplay how he managed to lance me? <laughs> like that. <laughs> it's like you head. never have a back scratcher. Yeah. Just like, <laughs> get off! <laughs> uh, okay. Um, okay. Chaos. Chaos. Two. Uh, one, two, three. three. Four. Y'all realize that if we get the wrong Five, chaos here, this six, is a TPK level seven, encounter? Eight. Nah, not possible. I count it. You have to get it. Or I count it. Nine, eight, eight or nine. Can't have nice encounter. That was pretty close. that last one, do good. Oh, nine. Nine? All right, do good's got nine. Do good's the official. That's like what? Or do good I'm is the saying. official counter. I'm already breaking so out. That's, uh, I don't need to break out more. It's like one to eighty-five. Right? Oh, wait, isn't boy. That's, Here we go. Wait, isn't that that's a rough wait. one. <laughs> Good luck, everybody. Not great odds. Guys, it's hold hands. <laughs> okay. Solidarity. It, it'll help. Wait, Marcus, <laughs> your right arm up. 94. Then... It does not hey. act. Oh! I will start. I got my chaos timer fixed. Chaos has been. is uh, The timer is active. Here we go, Next everybody. Here we go. Uh, top of the turn order again, starting with Dorg. Okay. 
Okay. Pump he's, that all, healing he's, a, he's all <laughs> he's all speedied up. Dork's got the zoomies. So first of all, like a dork, I'm gonna burn my entire lay on hands pool on myself. That's your action, correct? Yes, but okay. I have two. Um, that gives me another forty health. Nice. All right, back in the game. And now that I got that, I still have a bonus action. Hmm. Oh wait, no concentration because I got shield of faith up. Hmm. Uh, I believe you can use your your second attack has to be an attack action, right? Yeah. Oh yes, you're right. Yeah, when you hit attack the first time. Okay. Yeah. Or dis or dash, disengage, hide, or use an object. Wait, are smites concentration? No. Uh, not divine smite. Not divine smite. Okay. Only the spell ones. Only the actual spells. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okie dokie. Then we are just going to attack. Where is my lucky roll. die? Actually, you have advantage on this because of the guiding bolt. Oh yay! Okay, well, I already oh, got a nineteen, yeah, okay. so. 19 it is, plus uh, plus 10, so 29 to hit. You hit. Booyah. Then let's smack him. Um, right, 1d12 plus 7. Uh, yes, Helena? Yes. Oh, it does do that. I didn't know it did that. <laughs> it's a good spell, eh? That's, That's a good spell. spell. <laughs> Whoa. First, first hit is 18 damage. How much is that? Eight, 18 damage. 18 damage. Another meaty chunk cut into his thigh. Oh, calf, right. not thigh. You didn't hit that high. And I got my second attack, so we're swinging again. Nice. Um, Wait, how do you 20... get two attacks? Because I have a second attack. But you used your it's action extra, extra, it's extra. It's extra attack. But then you, you, you get to lay on hands? He, yeah, but you get an attack action that you can take. Not... Not yeah, the, ac the action, that you, but the action, the action you can take is an additional. Are we talking about haste? Oh, is this because of haste? Yeah, haste. Oh. haste. No, that's actually okay. So here's how haste is actually ruled. Haste is ruled. You get to make a single at weapon attack action, which is actually. Oh, never mind. It does say one weapon action. attack only. Yeah. Yeah, it's a. Uh -huh. it, I'm, I'm read. I am reading my spell now. Understandable confusion. It is a stupid wording. But yes, it is actually. It definitely, only one. I, I just I just saw in brackets says one weapon attack only. I know it's stupid. Why would they write that? Why would because they, they hate that? you. <laughs> they hate reading comprehension, um, and Wizards of the Coast hates everybody. Uh, so Our, they hate okay. Bard specifically. But yes, sadly, Dorg is only one attack. Would you like to smite on your on that other attack now? Uh, like how many spells? Oh boy. Um. Uh, oh. I believe you can use Channel Divinity to recover a spell slot. I, my Channel Divinity, no. Um, yes, wait, no, but Tasha's it's, Cauldron it, of Everything you can. That's he's referencing a special thing in Tasha's. Oh, okay. Uh, I just have two Channel Divinity options. I have Fury of the Tides and Marine Layer. Neither of which would be very helpful here. Mm -hmm. Um. Okay. So, all right. Then with that, I'm just going to use my movement action. I. Does haste double speed or just give me ten feet? Extra. Uh, wait. Um, hold on. I'll look it up real quick. Speed is doubled. Okay then. Boo yeah. I'm a. And you get a plus two bonus to your AC and advantage on dexterity saving throws. Oh my god, haste is crazy. Um, it's so good, except for when it ends. <laughs> oh, do I get a point of exhaustion or something? No, no you just. But you, you are. Can't take a turn just, for a turn. Oh shit. Okay. Let's hope this battle ends in less than a minute. All right. Um, I mean, that's like ten. That's like ten rounds. A minute so is a like, long time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Then I I'm gonna back up a solid. He's at the center line, right? Or he's is at he... the twenty. He's at if 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 we're counting the entire length as a hundred feet, he's at the twenty-five foot mark. All right. Then I'm gonna back up a solid fifty feet. Alrighty. Uh, as you back up, though, he's gonna make an opportunity attack. Mm -hmm. Oh boy! Um, all you right. have like a you have like a twenty four. Uh, yeah, twenty four AC. He has been rolling twenty five, so so twenty seven. Yeah, oh well, come he has, on! He has like a plus eight to strength, plus proficiency. So 
All right. You don't happen to have any shield rings or anything on you, do you? All I got is my shield of two-handedness. Oh, look at all those uh, D12s. Yeah. Um, that is a... Uh, 43 slashing damage. Are you kidding me? Yep. Yeah. Wow. And I, and I can't, I, and you can't cast shield on someone else. Damn it. Uh, I'm down. I'm down. You get I had 41 hit points. That's it. Uh, wait, hold on. What did you say he rolled? What did he roll to attack actually? Uh, this is a new round, right? Yeah. Uh, I could actually bend luck and lower that. I I didn't. Yeah, I can. Is it too late? You can do it. Okay, this will be the last of my sorcery. Points. I'll let you, but I'm yeah, no, I'm sorry. I, I did only. Yeah, a no, I'm bad. sorry. Um, what'd you say it was? Uh, you said you rolled a twenty-seven. Oh well, I only rolled a two. Can I? Do I get to use chat inspiration with no. bend luck or no? You're done. Yeah. You're done. <laughs> yeah, You're done, son. It it was it was just a question. Yeah, I, I, yeah, so I know, I, still I know. Take I, I'm just I'm being comically overzealous. Anyway, you, you yeah, are. If I, that was if a good thought, roll, though. No, that was a really if good I had, thought. If I had rolled a four, it would have actually made would have done it. But I would have done it. You try yeah, to you, you try to alter fate as it's happening right before you, but it seems as though that this was destined by some angry god, and this got straight through Dork, and Dork hasn't felt this in a long time. Blood leaving his stomach. Um, and he fall. This isn't the first time though. And he falls to the ground, uh, unconscious. It's always giant things that get the better of Dorg. I don't know. He's got a. It's a size issue. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Bigly, your turn. All right. Uh, I'm up. I will. I will attack. Note: his armor is still on fire. All of it. Yep. If you. This is a fancy DM way of saying, don't end your turn within five feet of him. So is it, the spell works like, if you're just like in his general five feet? Okay. Yeah, if you're able to attack him, you will be burned. Okay. Unless you want to take the chance in the con save, and would rather that. Although he did just use his reaction for the opportunity attack. No, no, no. I'm going to... I'm gonna attack twice. Okay. Roll First to hit. Attack, yeah. That is a seven. I'm gonna use D four. Twenty, dirty twenty. Dirty twenty hits. For 12, play us. 6, 18, and then I'm going to use my bonus action to activate the mandible power that's in oh, my tail. Yes. 2d8 poison damage, 15 constitution save. All right. He makes the con save. Okay, so half. Okay. 6 damage. Okay. So I think 24 overall. 24 overall damage. Is that for your two attacks or that first one? That was just the first one. Nice. Uh, do, 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 do. 15 minus. Do, 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 do. Let me do my math because math is hard. Chad, am I re inspired? I can re inspire you. Am I allowed to do that? I think someone just did. I'll allow you to do yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Thank you. Another 20, so that hits. Yep. Or nine, fifteen damage. Noise. And then I am going to back up thirty, thirty-five feet behind him, or like five feet down and then thirty feet out, or I'll oh. just jump. Alrighty, you jump off. I'll let you jump off of him. Okay. Um, he sadly already uses reaction on Dorg to down him. Um. But you managed to jump off and evade catching more of the flames. Um, how much did that last attack do? I didn't quite catch that. Uh, 15? Yes. Sure. 15 it yeah, is. Yeah, it was. Um, chaos, tables are Chaos tables available. Oh, um, 
<laughs> is there one that instantly revives all party members with full health and spell slots? Yes, there is. Actually. Probably. Actually. I was about to say there. I was about to say there. Probably. I was about to say there. Probably is one. There's a Who's hundred. down for a one in a hundred chance? Uh, but uh, so who's down for initiative scramble? <laughs> uh, I will so throw hands. I will Piggly, throw hands. With your, with your tail, you stab two quick jabs with the scorpion tail right into him, and you notice that it punctures quite uh -oh, deep. Chaos. 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 Oh my god. <gasps> Oh, Fiji, I can't oh. use the pants because that's a bonus action. I'm gonna get my fox and Wait, how many do we need to get to full anyway? Like four? Three. Three. Five. We need three. Actually, that no, is four. three. I four. thought it was five. I thought it was three. Five. Confirmed it's four. It's four. activation. This far? Okay. Oh. Or do good says 100. I, I, I'll count do good. You know what? We haven't had a full chaos table. Guaranteed activation, everybody. Here we go. Everyone, put in your guesses now. I guess 58. Initiative scramble. I but guess again. 30. <laughs> I'm, I'm saying it's going to be like a 70 something. 35. Ooh. Oh, that's oh. close said, to it. We've had 30. Right? Wait, who, said, who said 30? Someone said 30. 30. Yeah. Wait, no, wait, no, 53. Sorry, I read it. Ooh. All right, then. I'm close. Wait, did it. I don't think we've had 53 before. No. no. no I don't think so. Actually. Here we go. <laughs> he multiplies. No! Didn't, we already had that one, didn't we? We did already have that one, we yeah. We did have that one. Wait, we had 53 or 35? You had 35. No, we had, no, the, we had the multiply. We haven't had this number. Yeah, multiply yeah, was a different number. have not had 53 yet. Okay. We got for 53. Um, <laughs> maybe. I don't... Hmm, how do I do this one? Read it. Uh, let me think. Um, okay. This one's not very useful at all. Um, someone oh. gets a random uh, gets advantage on all ability scores for the next uh, for the next minute. For the next skill checks. Give me I mean, charisma, or, baby. For all skill Give me checks. <laughs> so. Yeah, that's one, not two. very helpful. Does that count for death saves? Helmsworth, congratulations! Hey, you there have we go. On all hey, skill checks yeah, yeah, yeah. For the next Negated minute. Negated the poison. Oh. Actually, for the, no, no, not for the next minute. For the next hour. Congratulations. Oh damn. Nice. To go with my poison. Wait, does that yeah. actually count? So in other words, it just yeah, it, it just it, it just negates it. <laughs> I just have to just aim. <laughs> Good job, chat. <laughs> that is stupid. I wanted on record that I had protection from poison prepared on a whim, and I didn't use my last spell slot because I wanted to cure Helmsworth. Oh, well. Aww. You know, Helmsworth thinks about this. Uh, I just want to let you guys know, if it was 35, someone else would be getting a death coin. Or perhaps Helena would be getting two death coins. Oh, death coin's 35? Uh, yeah, death coin's Hell 35. Yeah. Okay, yeah. We, wait, is that the way? I thought it was... Oh, wait, no, you ruled it differently because we weren't in combat. Yes. Okie dokie. So, that is that whose turn was it just ended with Piggly's turn. Yep. It is now Knight's turn. Uh, how many of you are within 50 feet of him? 50? Yeah. yeah. Um, Everyone. how close is my everyone. thing? I guess you'd have to be within 50 feet. Because... You're within six, 60. Yeah. <laughs> so. You're within 60. Okay. Everybody, you notice as he takes his spear, raises it to the sky, and a bolt of, of, uh, of this red, violent energy strikes it and then arcs out to all of you. I need all of you to make an intelligence saving throw. Does my aura of uh, protection still exist when I'm unconscious? Nope. Okay, then. Never mind. Is this magic, I'm assuming? Yeah. Okay. Oh, boy. Um, yeah. I don't have it. I don't have anything. This is it. Um... I could I could tie to chaos. I will. Chad, am I inspired? I'm that was inspired. somehow that was worse. That was worse somehow. Thanks, advantage. I'm assuming I am, but I just want to make sure. I'm inspired, I'm sure. I haven't used my inspiration yet. Um Hey, another two. Spud, you're inspired. Uh, okay. I'll just assume you are. It's okay. Uh nineteen. Okay. Uh, who all rolled below a 20? Jesus. <laughs> Buddy's safe. That's Bunny! our save. 
<laughs> so everyone else, you are safe from this. Uh, so Bunny, you are safe from this. Everyone else, enjoy. Uh, okay. So what you guys see, bef so everybody else, you see before you um, that for a moment you blink and all of a sudden there is three more of this same man. Bunny doesn't seem like there is. There's only one of them still for you. Everyone else, there are three as real as day standing before you. And they and, are violently. And they don't have rods in their pants. And they don't. <laughs> <laughs> Okie dokie. That is his turn. Helena, your turn. Right, okay. Um. Mm -hmm. So, is, but is Spud right about the um rod not being in pants? Or would I even see that? They're not Belt. in his pants. Uh, it doesn't seem like they are, at least right now. They're not really moving either Either way. So I can tell which one has the rod in his pants? Yes, you can. If, if... Okay. So that's the real one? Uh, you don't know for sure. Well, I mean, we don't know the other two are fake, though. Oh, yeah, all right, all right, all right. I hope what if not. Um, oh, oh, I love, um, oh, okay. How far away is Pigley? Piggly is I'm, behind the other knight. I, uh, didn't you say? Like I'm like sixty feet away from you. Okay. Um. You know what? I'm gonna go full send. Um. Uh. I'm gonna run. So how I'm I'm how far away from the knights? Uh. Where are you going? What are you planning on doing? I'm trying to get behind them, or like uh, by Piggly. There's no way you can do that without provoking an opportunity attack from one of the new knights. Yeah. You can risk it. I think I'm going to risk it. <laughs> she did 40 damage. I... Are you sure? There's... I do, it's not... I'll be fine. I have ranged attacks. Are you I can sure? Do. Okay, I'll because be I don't know if this... Okay, I'll, then I'll run to, like, where they can't attack me on, like, the side, and I'm going to cast Wall of Fire. Uh, like what orientation them? would you like to cast Wall of Fire such that it runs through them all? Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Wait, will that get Piggly? I'm 30 feet away no, from that. Wouldn't get Piggly. Oh, I, oh I went right. far. He's not. I thought you anymore. were still on the. I thought you were still on the back. Sorry. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh. Okay. What does Wall of Fire do, please? Oh my God. Yeah. Um. <clears throat> Although he resist this. I'm assuming that the, the, he doesn't matter. If he casts oh, right. mirror image, does do the duplicates have right. an attack yeah. as well? Oh, I mean, we don't know that it's mirror image, though. We just see if there's two others. We just know. We could probably deduce that there was one main one, but we have, would have no way of knowing that the other two are fake. So we know, oh, of like, course. yeah. Yeah. Um, you create a wall of fire on a solid surface within range. You can make the wall up to 60 feet long, 20 feet high, and one foot thick, or a ringed wall upon 20 feet in diameter, 20 feet high, and one foot thick. Uh, the wall is opaque and lasts for the duration. When the wall appears, each creature within its area must make a deck saving throw. On a failed save, the creature takes 5d8 fire damage or half as much damage. All right. So you see the two that just spawned. They have to make deck saves. The other one does not seem bothered by this at all. Uh, un unless your, does your fire adept thing do anything with people who are invulnerable to fire? No, only resistant. Sorry, homie. But the other ones, uh, what's your spell save, DC? Uh, 15. Count yourself lucky. They both fail. Roll damage. Let's go, Bateman. Put down my chips. <laughs> <laughs> um, two. Oh, D8? Oh, no, not the D6s. <laughs> um, one, two, three, four, five. <gasps> Yay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. Um, oh, boy. 29. Ooh, nice. 29. Uh, awesome. Okay. So these, these, these newly spawned knights seem all very... Surprised by this wall of flame just roaring to life in front of them. 
um, and they take the and they take the full brunt of the damage. Whereas the other one seems absolutely unbothered. Is he like impressed? Is he like, wow, that's a really cool light cleric? No. Roll for, <laughs> roll for being impressed. <laughs> um, let's see roll for now. you're all right, kid. <laughs> Bunny, it is now your turn again. Keep in mind, you don't see these knights. You were also the one who succeeded on the check. I want to cast. Wait, is there no? Ch- is there? Oh, do you not make another check at the end of your turn? Or oh, oh, right, right, right. Actually, actually, no, you don't actually make that. You have to do something else to get rid of this thing. Um, bestow curse. It's a wisdom saving throw of fourteen. Oh, he's wired. Uh, okay. Get cursed. Ooh, okay. <laughs> Sunflower. <laughs> um. He doesn't make it. He rolled a nine. Congratulations, hey. buddy. Let's go, baby. On a spell. <laughs> put that one up on the. T- put that one up on the tally. Yeah, what is what? What does Bunny say? Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> yeah. yeah! <laughs> um, what does this do? I can't she put read, it in chat. I can't read like the chat. Code? Otherwise, it'll screw up the layout. All of us? Uh, while cursed, the target must make a wisdom saving throw at the start of each of its turns. If it fails, it wastes its actions that turn doing nothing. Oof. Nice. While it's cursed, your Fucking attacks and spells do an funny. extra 1d8, cr- 1d8 necrotic to the target. Uh-huh. Is that spells in general or okay. just spells that Bunny makes? Uh, it's only their attacks. Uh, the person, the caster's attacks. Um, what ability score... What ability score would you like to have disadvantage... Uh, would you like this thing to have disadvantage on? Choices being strength, dexterity, constitution, wisdom, intelligence, charisma. Strength or wisdom, right? Strength, 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 strength. Strength? Okay, strength. Sa- okay, this creature now has disadvantage on strength saving throws. And ability checks. Okie dokie. Oh, wait, no, attack rolls aren't ability checks. Yeah, I just remembered that as well. Oh, wait, yeah. Uh, Helmsworth, your turn. All right, I'm going to finish it. Finish that thing i was making all right so you have that, succeeded yeah. in making the ice cannon it is a yeah. strange contraption that helms earth has managed to put together utilizing shape water a five turn con- m- at disaster of a thing that uh <laughs> that once fired will in fact shoot an ice ball quite hard Oh, I love it. Helm's Earth is Santa Claus. <laughs> oh, for, oh, oh. for everyone questioning, <laughs> this does in fact, this will. Uh, it takes five turns to set up and utilizes the various different rules of simultaneous effects and whatnot of shape water. It's a cantrip. <sighs> but he's done I it. Sent him a power, I sent him a PowerPoint <laughs> explaining <laughs> how it all works. He legit sent me a whole ass PowerPoint to prove to me that it works, and God damn it, it does, so I let him do it. But there you go. Uh, but that you finish it this turn. You do not get to fire it this turn. Um, okay, yeah. But, uh, and now, it's done. It's done, though. And now, now my bonus action ice. is... And now my bonus action is free, so I'm going to cast Hex on it. Yeah. Okay. On which one? Um, The... The the main one, what, because the two ones would have appeared. The two ones would have appeared from somewhere else, right? So uh, whichever it one what... out of him. Okay, so if they appeared out of him, I'm just going to go for that main. I'm going to put it on that main one. Okay, go for it. He is now hexed. Uh, uh, you, you. Oh, oh, right. There's no there's no save for it. Yeah, That's you nice. just you swirl your sword and this uh, ethereal fist reaches out and crushes around it. Um, he is now hexed. Uh, it is now time for for legendary. And he has disadvantage on wisdom ability. Wait, hold on. Ability checks. Uh, it's ability checks. It's not saving throws. I wish it was. Saving yeah, I know, uh, but I get to, I get to choose an ability though. Yes. Um, Which would you uh, like? Uh, 
I guess I'll go with wisdom, I guess. Wanna... Nice. He's now disadvantaged on wisdom saving throws. Mm. It is now time for legendary actions. So, uh, main knight is going to look at Helena, uh, who's been currently causing a lot of commotion, um, and he is going to throw his javelin at you. Mm -hmm. uh, enjoy. Mm -hmm. uh -oh. Dodge. Uh, twenty-one. Yeah. Yikes. <laughs> Oops, I've been impaled. T -P -K. T -P -K. <laughs> uh, that is. I rolled low. So it's thrown. Lovely. It can't be that much. Don't say that. <laughs> uh, how does 38? Okay. Are you not downed? Oh, no, honey. Oh, good job. We got that temp yeah. HP gun. So. He throws this javelin. It, it got it, gashes straight through you. A lesser being would have died outright, but you manage to dodge just out of the way, such that it gasses, that it, such that it, it cuts through your arm and part of your torso. But you're still mostly okay. Otherwise, you're bleeding, but you're okay. But I look hot, really hot, right? Because now Dorik sounds like I'm now the hottest one in the party. You've been impaled. You're impaled. <laughs> <laughs> You know what? You're extra impaled I may be unconscious, now. but I am a beautiful corpse. I'm extra <laughs> impaled? Is that what you just said to me? Yeah, you're extra <laughs> impaled now. Um, it should be noted, though, you are now immobile, as there is a javelin sticking out of you. Congrats. Oh. Um, uh, it is now time for the other knight's legendary actions. Uh... What, oh, right, uh, the other ones. Pigley, Helmsworth, and Helena, you all see oh, this happening. Uh, okay. The other one is going to throw a javelin at Helmsworth. <laughs> he'll try. Uh, 26 to hit. Yeah, and he'll succeed. <laughs> <laughs> uh, enjoy, javelin. Uh, this one does more damage. Of course it does. <laughs> Sorry. What is going on? Actually, it does the exact same. 39. Actually, does more. Is that the same? Oh. Yeah, it's the same. 39 damage. No, I got 31, I thought. Oh, 39 then for Helmsworth, though. That's This is definitely 39. Okay, so I have 16 extra health. And uh, 16, you said 39? So yes. that's like 24? 24? 24 left? Okay. You get javelined. You are now also. Uh, and how? You are uh, how much? How much is it gonna? How much is that con save gonna be? What's half of thirty-nine? That's like a half DC twenty. Ooh, half of thirty-nine. 18. That is a. 19. That's like a. 18. That's like a DC twenty. Eighteen. Yes. Okay. Round it down. It's gonna be a tough con save. Actually, Helena, is Wall of Fire a concentration spell? It is. Yeah. Uh, please make a con save for me. I have advantage on those. That's good. <laughs> I thank God I do. <laughs> uh, Six. Oh wait. While um, the fire goes down. Wait, I'm making. Am I making? It's an 18 for me, right? Yes. Okay, I just made it. Nice. I, will, I, I did an um, And now it is time for the third knight's turn. Who's going to throw a javelin at Pigley? No! Why are we gonna get hit with this? Okay. By the way, Helena, yours was was slashing. Helmsworth, yours was psychic. Pigly. Of course. It, uh, yeah, there how much go. health does this thing have? It's a giant, a lot. Uh, Pigly, how uh, 23 to hit? Uh, is this a new round or the same round? Same round. Then, yeah. Um. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> I keep laughing because I'm scared. 33 da uh, psychic damage. Ah. All right. It is now time for the new round. Yay. Yay. Dorg. Let's Death see. saving throw. Oh. 
Not 20! He's back! Dork is back! Mac is back! <laughs> Dork wakes up, he's like, I'm not finished! And he I'm grabs his great yet. sword. One HP, Dork, is on the field. Piggly, your turn. Before you do anything, I'm going to ask you to make an intelligent saving throw. Uh, is, is the effect magical? Yes, you can't okay. see it though. That's fine, it just says against magic. Okay. So against seeing stuff is dexterity. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, Seventeen. All right, nothing happens. You still My see, turn? You still see the knights. It is now your turn though. Okay. Am I assuming immobilized? You or are no. immobile, yes. Okay. You can uh, remove the spear, though, with a successful athletics check. Will that take an action? That will take an action, yes. Okay, I'm not going to do that. Also, where am I on the battle? Like, when I die from the opportunity Wait attack... Wait a minute, I... Dorg, your, Dorg, your aura, it's plus three to, to people. Yeah. Oh, but he's within ten feet of me, that's why I was... Yeah. I oh, was no, not he's not within ten feet of you. He's too far away. Sorry. Uh, do you happen to have the the pistol stat sheet? <laughs> I didn't write down the customizations for the pistol you gave me. Is it the same? Do you happen as to my remember pistol? what it was? No. Uh, it was two okay. d eight, I believe. Uh, dexterity rolls, no proficiency. Okay. What about the dagger <laughs> that I can shoot? Uh, the dagger you have to use within melee range. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. I'm it's going to, unless I'm wrong. If I'm wrong, someone in chat tell me. I thought the pistol was like a range thing where it would like, it's, it's it was like the Black Ops knife where it shoots out. And then I, remember, because I impaled the thing from a distance on the range. Oh, right. Okay, sorry. When I play tested it, I used it differently. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. You can use this, uh, you can use this at range. Use it. Okay. Is it, does it hit like a regular dagger? Do you remember or no? Uh, yes, it does hit like a regular dagger, but it has extra effects that you haven't tested, that you haven't seen in combat yet. Okay. Uh, so I'll make... Send him to the moon! <laughs> I'll shoot the dagger at the middle guy, the dude with the rod in his belt. All right. Roll to hit. This is going to be a raw strength roll. No, no proficiency. Okay. Unless I gave you proficiency and I can't remember. I don't remember. I was going to ask you on break, but this yeah. happened before. Uh, to everyone trying to see if this is a range thing, this is a homebrew item. Stop bringing yeah. raw into this. You're going to screw yourselves up. Don't think uh, too hard. Going to use luck. Uh, 18 base. 18 base. What's your strength modifier? Uh, plus 4. So that is 22. 22. Alrighty, that hits. So you, as a last ditch effort, you pull out your knife, you twist the, the, the charge stone, and you see this blade like a small ballistic missile just streak out of the handle. And the blade impales itself into the side of this, of the, the knight. Um, it, impale it would send this knight flying if not for the immovable rod currently shoved down his pants. Um, but Ooh, it is that's some, like, ricochet damage, though. <laughs> that's some, like, uh, It's gonna be like, ah! It's gonna pull on his stomach. Whiplash! Stom it's gonna pull on his stomach, but it's not gonna do any extra effects. Um, this would it, like, rip his pants off? He's got a strong belt. Uh, <laughs> strong belt. Giant's belt. <laughs> He's got a Gucci belt. Um, Gucci gang. I need more D eight for this. Don't say that. <laughs> no, definitely say that. No, this is my attack. This is good. Oh, yay! <laughs> say more. I'm just gonna roll it in uh in the Offbeat Outlaw Discord. Come check it out, guys. Oh man, the Offbeat Outlaw Discord. I've heard that's a cool place. I've, I've heard, heard that's, that's a fun a place to cool hang place. out, meet friends, and other fans of Offbeat Outlaw content. Excellent moderators too. Oh my god. Excellent moderation. <laughs> help us help us be noticed by, by Discord Senpai. 
That deals a whopping 30. Oh, wow. Did you see that roll, chat? Did you you would if you roll? were in the Discord. You would have. <laughs> did, did you see 36? 37 uh, piercing damage as this knife juts into it um, and punctures out of its side like a gunshot. The center guy is looking pretty banged up. He's looking, he's looking quite wounded. Um, yikes, he's looking, he's looking very <laughs> wounded, actually. How wounded is he? Enough. Uh, okay. He's looking very badly wounded. He, he's noticeably struggling now. However, it is his, Same. it is his turn now. Mm. Um... And this is what he's been setting up for for this turn. He raises his he raises his halberd to the sky, and you hear him bellow out in a deep, commanding voice. Armies to battle, and they are all going to make a series of attacks. Uh, oh, two oh, two no. of which on Helena, two of which on Piggly, none of which on Bunny, uh, two of which on Dorg. Wait, Bunny, do something that does damage on your turn, attack? please. <laughs> please, you gotta do something, Bunny. Get that rapier up, Bunny. Wait, who's making the attacks? Uh, actually, no, wait. Dorg never got hit by this. So it's yeah. only... So one of the knights is actually charging all the way to Helmsworth's ass uh, to whack him. Another one... The, the main knight is going to is, is going to be casting two spells at you, Helena. And then the other, in theory, um, in, the other knight is going to be attacking Piggly. So, uh, Dork doesn't see any of this, though, but he is going to watch his friends just get murked. Good luck. If I rolled well, what the fuck? Um, <laughs> <laughs> this is abysmal. Oh, no. This is a tragedy. This is a tragedy. <laughs> Two nat ones. Um, Aha. Oh, with a one in 40 chance. Well, uh, so this is a... 25, 25, uh, there's a, okay, okay, let me, let me pair these up. 25, uh, and a 1 on Helena. Okay. So 25 nice. and a, an 11 on Helmsworth. 25 and a 16 on Piggly. Okay. Okay, how many of the so only one of those hits on Helena? So let's roll your damage first. One of the knights, well, the the main knight, casts two blasts, almost swinging the blade off of his halberd that he resummons to his back. That is going to be fifteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-eight, some psychic damage. Um, Dorg, you notice as. Uh, Helena, her my uh, as she she just passes out before you. Um, Piggly, uh, twenty five and a, a seventeen. Which how many of those hit? Is it a seventeen or a sixteen? Oh, sixteen. Sorry, sixteen. Okay, so sixteen doesn't hit. I'm gonna use luck to make you reroll the twenty five. Uh, okay. <laughs> that's your third burn of luck, right? Yeah, it's my last luck. Okay, that misses. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Better and boy, Piggly. Helmsworth. Uh, both of yours miss. Oh. Woo. Neat. Actually, no. Wait. No. Wait. No. Wait a minute. Yeah. I've. Really? Okay. No, no, no. One of them hits. One of them has got to hit. <laughs> I wasn't gonna bring it up. <laughs> <laughs> I got confused. Uh, one of them hits. Uh, unless you can do anything about it. It's a 26. Wait, 26? How much was it? How uh, much did I say? It was a 25. 25. It was a 25. Um, Thank you, Dugan, for keeping track. I am... Uh, if, I ha uh, if I hadn't tried to save Dorg, I could have saved myself. <laughs> <laughs> That's an, that's an act. If I if I use Ben Luck, I could have used a Ben Luck shield. Come, actually, wait, no, I couldn't. I couldn't. Ben Luck is also a reaction. It doesn't matter. I was screwed either so, way. Oh, okay then. I don't Damn feel bad from anymore. The beginning. Um. Uh, there's got to be something I can do. No, no, there's nothing. That's it. Uh. God, I was just gonna be. I was gonna be able to uh, fire the cannon. I, mean, I will say Helmsworth. 
as you lose consciousness, the cannon will fire. Yay! Ooh, that's can, a fun... <laughs> can anyone fire the cannon? It's just gonna go off. I'm a, is it concentration? Well, kinda. It's an interesting case. It's... It's got a lot of moving parts to it. Well, <laughs> I'm assuming of... this is a Helmsworth thing. <laughs> yeah, this is a this is a jank thing that he put together. Okay, so I get to psychic damage. Uh, wait, 26 psychic damage. Oh, I'm still up. Yes. Hey. Nice. Helmsworth, Barely. the beefy boy. <laughs> He's been lifting. <laughs> I I do cardio. <laughs> Well, that attack was less successful than I was anticipating. Uh, I w but uh, <laughs> looks like you're, uh, a few of you, only one downed was Helena. Sorry. Um, uh, it would have been Helena's turn, but but it is her turn. Use a death saving throw for me, please. Come on, that twenty. How's a nat one look? <laughs> <laughs> That's actually very we, bad. We better oh, kill geez. it this round, boys. <laughs> Well, That's considering two death this saves. game, we ruled it that Nat 20 is auto success. Wait, wait, hold on. Hold on. No! Hold on. Hold wait, on. Wait, no. wait, wait, everybody, hold on. Everybody, hold on. everybody, everybody, shush. Everyone shut your mouths. Helena? You feel a lot of pain. It's fair. The blades sink into you. And you feel a tug at your leg as you feel your body leave you. But right as you're about to go, something burns a hole in your pocket. Ah, uh, the coin. A coin that you got oh so long ago. Now, instead of a pure charcoal black, it now has flaming red accents. And you hear a ringing in your voice saying, Would you like to make a bargain? <laughs> what kind of bargain? What's the deal? Spend your coin, and you won't go to the afterlife. But next time, I won't be so lenient. Are you the one who gave me it? Yes. Oh, thank you I so much. I saw hope in you. <laughs> Stop. Don't um, take it personally. Okay. Um. So if I give it to you, that's it. There's nothing I have to do after that. There's nothing you owe me, I owe you. I don't have any weird conditions. It's just I'm back. There is one condition. That's what I thought. What is it? Next time you are brought to this state, coming here will be a lot easier. Oh. Game talk. Yeah. One death save. You only need to make One. two. You only need to make two death. You only need to fail two death saves to be killed. Okay. Wow! 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 Uh, <laughs> oh, wow! 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 Oh, wow! 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 I should let you know, Helena. You are only dead in a dream. I know. That's the other yeah, thing I was wondering. If you want wondering. to spend this now, you'll wake up in your body, but you will be gone from your friends. Um, so then, okay, question. If I say I'm going to keep the coin, am I dead in the dream? You're dead in the dream, and you will be and you'll be kicked out of the tournament. With no chance of getting the, the, the godly boons of Eternagrax. She's out either way. Can we take a break right now so I can think about it? <laughs> it's 9.30, can we take yeah, it? <laughs> You know what? Sure, I need to take a piss. <laughs> Thank you, everybody, for watching so far. We will be back at 9.45 to finish up the rest of this of this combat. Helena will make her decision, and maybe we'll get on with the rest of this damn tournament. Anyway, bye bye See you at 9.45.
Hello, everybody. Hello, Welcome back to this lovely, jubbly, very fun <laughs> game of Dungeons and Dragons. Where we last left off, Helena was just downed through psychic force and has been, uh, has been dead. She's dead now, but she's not exactly <laughs> dead. Uh, she's dead only in a dream, but more importantly, she has a specific magic item, the coin of death, which... Death itself has come to let her know that he's ready to make a bargain for that coin. Letting her know that if she would like to go back at full HP with all of her spell slots refilled, she can do so for one coin. But her death saves will be permanently damaged, meaning that she will only have to fail two in order to be killed. But she will still have to succeed at three. Death has let her know this, and she was about to make her decision when we needed to cut to break for reasons. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so, Liz, mm. what is your decision? I'm going to hold up the coin. Mm -hmm. Do I see Death, or I just hear Death? You kind of just hear him, but you know where to offer it. Okay. I'm going to offer it. I'll take the deal. All right. You hand out, out the coin, and the skeletal hand of death just emerges in front of you and delicately plucks the coin from your hand. He whispers to you, A most wise decision. I am. Um, my wisdom is 18. Very good. <laughs> I shall have you know that if you would like more of these coins, contact me at midnight. Oh, Okay, Cinderella. <laughs> Did I say that to death? <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> he says, but it should be known. Spend more than three, and you're gone for good. And with that, you are shunted back into your body, full HP. Full Let's go, baby! Wait, what, what, do we, what do we see? So you watch as... Helena, like, just, die. you watch, like, the, all the blood and color just drain from her face. Uh, to those not, uh, shy from battle. You know this to be a dead corpse appearing right before your eyes. But, before it seems as though this transformation from person to corpse is complete, you watch her open her eyes again, wider than ever. The spear inside of her, uh, well, what she sees, the spear inside of her snaps in half. Um, and she is awake, up, and ready to go. Is it my turn? Um, I thought that that was my, I thought that that was my thing. <laughs> it looks, looks like it. It's what Helmsworth says when he sees all of this. <laughs> <laughs> um, the warrior, um, for the first time in its life, looks confused at you, Helena. Um, and that was from its, that was from its, that was from your failed save. You recover with your action at the ready. Ooh. Oh, bet. Um, all right. I'm V angry. Wait, right? wait, how does this I'm work like... initiative wise? She's, it's just back in it's her turn back, order. It's just her she turn. Just gets oh, her action okay, okay, yeah. okay, 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 okay. No okay. problem, homie. I'm big mad. Mm -hmm. I'm like, well, what was that? Right? Oh, with a fire, if you will, um, in my belly. Um, I'm going to cast Guiding Bolt at a fourth level at this dude. Mm-hmm. So. I'm big mad. At what level? Fifth level? Fourth. I don't have fifth level spells. Well, you got a hit first. Roll the hit. I bet. All right. Nineteen. Oof. What? Not Can hit. you use chat inspiration? No. Is that, no, is that possible? <laughs> Roll a d20 Charisma check on the dungeon master What if I just told you it's International Women's Day Don't play that card <laughs> <laughs> Um Okay Um 17 um, I, got, I rolled a natural 18 So it's minus 17 Fine <laughs> Ah. Um, that's 
two, so that's 21. You hit. <laughs> my kill it. Oh, please. Oh, that'll be... That'll be neat, but I'll also be disappointed because I don't get to fire my ice kick. Oh, <laughs> All no. that work. All that stuff. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven. Come on. This will be fun. Um... Twenty-five. So you take this bolt, you not like other girls with a renewed life in your eyes, literally, you <laughs> send a bolt of blazing heat towards it. It punctures through its shoulder, but it stands. Ooh. It still stands. Let's go, hell's worth. <laughs> and it looks it's your mighty turn. angry. Legendary. Is it my turn? Oh, Doesn't funny. Bunny go before me? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Legendary action. Uh, Helena, uh, <laughs> this is a nasty one. My apologies. That's okay. I don't, I don't yet agree the moment. Uh, but, Send it uh, back! Send it back! Send <laughs> <laughs> uh, it back. Uh, he, this, this beast reveals the front side of his shield, and you notice for this first time the insignia of a, of a devil or fiend of some kind, and its eyes glare right into you. Make a charisma saving throw. Oh, I'm so good at these. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, you've been you've been rolling well on these charisma checks. Nineteen. Mm, not good enough. <gasps> oh. Uh, oh no. What was the DC? Let me ask. Uh, twenty. <laughs> You That's just had a roll move. just because oh you felt. God. You just had a roll because you felt like it. You said this. <laughs> um, oh man! You <laughs> rolled so low on the damage, uh, but um, Liz, uh, you mm -hmm. feel um, a bull. You feel a, a, a rising welling fear, and then all of a sudden, a complete calm. And all of a sudden, everyone around you looks vaguely villainous, unless you are resistant to charm effects in any way. Am I? To be fair, I always oh. look villainous. I, I, Caroline is I making Caroline's noise. Clapping. I, I want... want to cast counter charm. Who <laughs> counter charm? This Can is you one do like that as a times. reaction? I mean, it's a counter. I, I'm looking. I'm looking. I've actually never heard of this spell either. Oh my god, I still think everyone's just gonna t Oh no, fireballs for everyone. <laughs> Thank you, Caroline. Uh Caroline, is it a is it a re sorry, I missed that. Was it a, is it a reaction? Or have we not seen yet? Counter charm. At sixth level you gain the ability to use your musical notes. As an action. As an action. Oh no. And it has okay. It's smart though, that was smart, that was smart. But we'll keep that in mind. We have, we have a chance. We, we but, have time. Uh, Helena, you are every um where your allies once were, you see devils and fiends, creatures most foul. And the night is nowhere to be seen. No! Oh. And you take That's so cool. <laughs> you take eight plus four, twelve plus twelve is twenty-four. Is twenty is twenty six, and then that's twenty. That's thirty one, and that is uh, that's thirty two. <laughs> thirty two okay. psychic damage. Bap, 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 bap. Uh. <clears throat> Wait, would Helena still be under the effects of the aid spell? She would be, because she technically, she died. Right? I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm asking. Ooh, I'm gonna say it's no. It's five. Cause it's five. It's five. It's five HP. I'm so. gonna say no. She would not be under the effects of aid. This is like a new, a fresh, like completely fresh long rest, whatever. Um, Good morning, sunshine. You're all getting fireballs. Okay. <laughs> uh, Bunny, <laughs> it is now your turn. Oh. For charmed, do you roll once on each of your turns to get out of it? Uh, or how yeah. does charmed work? Uh, so that's how. That's how this one's gonna work anyway. I want to use my throwing daggers. Okay. I don't know what I have to roll for that. 
That is a dexterity attack roll. So roll your d20, add your dexterity modifier, and then your proficiency bonus to see if the attack hits. Mm -hmm. To those wondering who just got here after break why Bunny is not speaking today, she is on vocal rest. Because uh, voice gone gone for Bun Bun. <laughs> 21 that hits nice. roll damage d4 plus your proficiency bonus not proficiency your dexterity modifier dexterity yeah, dexterity, yeah. <clears throat> bunny 6 you take your knife. You mark the spot. You take your blade. You throw it with all your might. The blade oh. flies through the air in a moment of slow motion. Everyone's air is, in, is up. <laughs> it careens into the eye socket of the beast. It goes dark. Silence. And he falls. Yeah! yeah! My ice cannon. Over. God but damn it. My ice cannon. Bunny. <laughs> I spent all. Do I see this happen yet? On that. Or like. E every, oh, you, man. you all turn and see Bunny like mid throw. Like after the, the blade is like. She's like still standing there looking so cool. And the crowd. Elsworth's happy, roars. but he's very clearly. Elsworth's happy, but he's very clearly like. <laughs> Your life's work, but the crowd just, is just fire it cheering. at the body. <laughs> Bonnie, Bonnie, it works. Bonnie, 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 and Bunny goes, Bonnie, Bonnie, Bonnie. <laughs> the, Do I, the, are my friends back? Do I see my friends, or are they still devils? Your, your friends are back. Yeah, they turn oh, back good, into good. they turn back into people instead of oh uh, devils. But every but the the crowd is 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 roaring. The god of combat. Sitting in his throne up there, uh, is pouting. He gets up from his seat and he leaves. He leaves the arena after watching his champion get bested by five idiots. Uh, <laughs> looks, like, looks like he's a champion of sore and losing. That's what he's <laughs> you, you guys, <laughs> that's what he's guy. cold. She kills that guy. Doesn't even say a word. <laughs> <laughs> she said huzzah. Uh, Eternograx speaks out to the Coliseum. Congratulations to the champions. Please return back to your locker rooms, for the next combat will begin for the next <sighs> fight champions. You all return, and may now gain the benefits of a short rest. Oh, fuck. Ooh. Oh, guys, I'm, I'm running on empty here. We got hit dice, don't we? Or mm. some of us do. Uh, you... Eternograx steps into your into your chambers and says, All right, so your next fight is within four hours. But this is going to be for the finals. A lot of people have lost so far. Congratulations. This round Eternograx, I have a question. Yes. I straight up died out there, right? I mean, you're still here. I mean, but like, was oh, I was like, for like, Two seconds, I was just like, and then I came back. I mean, it happens to the best of us. It's true. Um, yes. Please. What are you at? <laughs> what are you asking about this? Um, was it like nasty? Was there like blood and stuff? You got impaled. Oh yeah. <laughs> no, none of you were. Uh, uh, none of you were impaled. No, you were under the effects of a psychic spell. He made you think oh. and believe that there were two other fighters there, I, I assume, or more? Yes. Yes, they weren't actually there. If you had successfully looked at the creatures, you would have noted they were images, but your brain was tricked into believing they were real and thusly suffered the effects. Yes, what? Bunny. What? When? This battle? Yes, Bunny, this battle. <laughs> you managed to save off the effects of the spell, but uh, the rest of your combatants were not so lucky. Oh. I always did have a strong imagination. Uh, well, take it from Helmsworth, dying's never the end, is it? 
I have a question. Yes. You said, is this next fight the finals, or is the next fight to get to the finals? Next fight is the finals. Next fight, okay. Helmsworth, congratulations. You didn't die this time. I lost money this round. I thought it would be you. Uh, well, <clears throat> that's now what you I'm get for betting to... against me. I'm going to give you all some good luck for this run. I know some of you are in need of a long rest. This you got any boots? <laughs> this will cost some of your... This will, will cost... This won't be for free, but I can give you those benefits right now. What's the cost? Well, what does it cost? You won't be back at your full health. About 75% of it, but everything else will be restored. I mean, that's pretty neat. What does everything else mean? Spell slots. Yeah. I'm taking it. I is the is this an individual thing or is this like all take, or nothing? You can take it into you can take it into each of you can take it individually. Is there any reason why we shouldn't take this? Are there any other costs associated? No. I think meta wise, I think if you're at full health, you don't need it. That's one way to think about it. If you can recover all your health and all of your resources via short rest, you should probably take that instead. If you are above 75% and you take it, do you go down to 75 or are you still where you're at? You will be brought down to 75%. Mm -hmm. Yes. I'm taking it. Okay. I'm going to take it as well. I'm going to take it and then I'm going to use my short rest. Bunny is going I'll to... also take I will also take it. You guys can still take your short rest on top of this as well. Oh, really? Yeah, if you want to spend uh, your hit dice. Oh, that's... then there's really no... <laughs> I just want you guys to use your hit dice and get your and get your shit back. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Cool. And I'm assuming aid's gonna be gone after all this, right? Yeah, it will be. Okay, and I can change out my spell. I can change out like my, my one spell, right? Mm-hmm. Cool. Um, that's gonna be a hard choice. Cool. Okay, so just to make sure, we can take the long rest and then also take a short rest with hit die. Yes. Or wait, is this like um, we take the long rest and then the short rest afterwards, or we take the long Same rest time. but it has to function? Same okay, time. okay, okay. Same time. Yes. Okay. Uh, so, you guys do this. Eternagrax lends you some of his magical power. It just kind of auras off of him for those who accept this deal. Um, and you, you for this, for this, you guys, it takes an hour of, uh, off of your time. Uh, same for it take the same amount of time it would take for a short rest, and you are brought back uh, with whatever uh, benefits that you get from making this bargain. He turns to you and says, "All right, those magic weapons—they uh, should be changing right about now." Oh, we have um, those. One more question: um, <laughs> We get spell slots back. Do we get any other abilities back that can we only be used once per long rest? Yes, all those will be back too. Anything yes. that you get back in a long rest is back, except for the health. And which you would have to do a short rest for, which you can take at the same time. Um, okay, for those magical items, what we now, you guys now are gifted. Um, Okie dokie. Let us, let me, let me see what magic items. Goodbye, Vorpal Sword. <laughs> oh, yeah, rip. <laughs> goodbye, oh, magic rod. <laughs> goodbye, goodbye, ring of. Ridiculously ring of overpowered of sword. Oh, my God, that it thing was, is dude. crazy. Yeah, it's nutty. Uh, all right. Uh, there is a vicious longsword. What does the viciousness do? Uh, it does Let's an see. extra plus. It does an extra modifier to damage on critical hits only. Oh, okay. Um, uh, mm -hmm. There is it's fine. There is a ring of protection, plus two to your AC if you're wearing it. Ooh. There is a headband of intellect, uh, which will bring up your intelligence to 19. Me? Mm -hmm. Um, okay. That's a, that's a, that's a, that's a, <laughs> this is a, this is a good item. Mm -hmm. Uh, okay. Which one do I pick from this now? 
I'm rolling d20s to see which ones you get. I've got like a table. Yeah. This one, this one, I just wrote down really good item with a nat twenty because I didn't think I was gonna roll it, but I'm an idiot, so obviously. <laughs> <laughs> why, why, why would you write down really good item? Because I'm a dumbass. I love okay? that. I'm stupid. I I love... No, you're not. No, you're not. <laughs> yes, I am. I'm a dungeon master, and I didn't prepare for the obvious <laughs> thing that was gonna happen. That's good golly. It's like saying, it's like saying, it's like saying, it's just like saying if you rolled a one, ah, uh, crap, you can get a crappy item if I roll a one. <laughs> There's no way it will roll a natural 20. <laughs> I mean... Uh, yes? Marcus said I would roll a natural 20 in my death save, and I got a natural 1, so like... That was a jinx. There, there's always a chance. Morg is that. sorry. Are you or something, huh? <laughs> you know what? Screw it. I'm just gonna homebrew an item on the spot. What do y'all want? <gasps> um, I want... I want a, something with lightning. Okay, lightning? Mm-hmm. Okay, uh, Dork, give me, give it, what do you want? A really big sword! Okay, <laughs> Piggly, what do you want? I'm fine. Also, yes, the Ring of Industria punching is another option that I would <laughs> Oh, are we not all creating one together? Uh, are they really? Uh, I, I thought we could be doing that, but that's okay. Uh, we'll see what happens. Bunny, what, what do you want? Shit kicking <laughs> boots. Awesome. How about what do you want? <laughs> I want. Something that makes my spells hit better, and like, like, essentially just like a like a plus one, but for like, like a plus something, but for like my spells. <laughs> you want That's a plus one wand? Adderall, but for spells. <laughs> okay, it's a play? thing because there's like sh there's yeah, like I, shards. I know what you're you're right. Right. Okay, okay, okay. Can it there's play a... like an eight bit theme when it hits? I just wanted to do that when it's working. I just want to hear like a little tune. Um, it'll play... Okay, okay. Uh, here's what we're gonna get. Oh no. What have we done? <laughs> okay. Baywild should be pretty funny. Okay. Zorg wanted big sword, right? Yeah. There already is a big sword. The vicious sword should do. It's a vicious long sword. Oh, uh, um, which you I could... think do something with spell casting. Hmm? Mm, okay. We don't have like a spellcasting thing yet. Okay. Here's what's gonna. Here's what it is. Uh, wand of great lightning. Here's what it does. It is a plus two uh, wand, meaning all attack rolls uh, and damage rolls get plus two to them that you make with this wand. Um, Do saving throws get plus two? Uh, not saving throws. Attack rolls and damage rolls. Um, with with the wand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your DCs are unaffected. Um, what it also does is um, lightning spells with it. Uh, if you ca if you are to cast a lightning spell with this wand, as a bonus action, you may spend a charge to double its effects. You may do this once per long. You may do this once per day. Um. Wait, you, wait, uh, so you can double lightning stuff? Yes, you can double whatever lightning thing you just cast. Um, as a bonus action, once per day. Uh, um, how would that work for something like Witch Bolt? Two like Witch persistent? Bolts. So like, okay, so instead of it doing 1d12 per round, this 2d12 per yes. round? Yes. Um, it also has... Uh, And um, one more thing. Let's give it one more one more aspect. Uh, when you when you cast a spell with it, it makes a really loud noise. Kaboom! Not a song. Uh, it plays uh, "Thunder and Lightning" by Danny Sexbang from Ninja Sex Party. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, as you swing it, uh, that is your that is your that is your magic item. Thank um, you, Offbeat. No problem. That was really cool. Um. You all that was three items. You also get uh, gloves of missile snaring. Ooh, those are neat. And another nat. <laughs> like the same face. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we can help out. We can help out. We can help out. We can do it again. Nope, Passing yeah. exercise. I just gave you spell thing. Uh, now we'll give you sword thing. Um. Um. You know what? Fuck it. Uh, big fucking sword. That's the name of it. 
Um, it is a, <laughs> it has a reach of 10. You must have a strength of at least 19 to wield it. Um, oh. do any of you have that? Uh, what's the highest strength in this party? Actually, no, I have 18. Yeah, we both have 18. Okay, you have to have a strength <laughs> of at least 18 to wield it. Uh, <laughs> gotcha. Um, however, Big Fucking Sword has a property known as Clumsy. You may not add your proficiency bonus to the attack rolls. You can only add your strength modifier to the attack rolls to hit to see if the thing if the weapon hits. However, mm. every attack you hit with it is a critical hit. You might oh. regret that. Why well, might? I'm being this nice. <laughs> I might, but this is a boss fight, so have fun. The uh, screenshot all of our faces right there. Uh, <laughs> Uh, it, it's whatever. I don't. Yeah, I'll take either of the swords. Whatever okay, you want. so we have we have you the go vicious for it, sword. Dude. We have the vicious long sword, ring of protection. Uh, uh, the lightning. The the lightning. We'll call it the lightning rod. Um, gloves of missile snaring, and the big fucking sword. I'm what gonna take the BFS. Okay, gloves of missile snaring allow you as a reaction to reduce the damage of any. Project of projectiles. Well, that have been great last time. Would have been. Um, <laughs> Actually, what does it work against magic projectiles? I thought it only worked uh, against. It just says ranged weapon attack. It, yeah, it has to be a weapon attack. So that'll be like a, a, a like a, a lance being thrown at you, not spells. Specific, like not. It'll be like lance, arrows, that stuff, not spells though. I'll take whatever is left last. You guys can choose. Okay. I mean, I'll take the lightning rod if no one else wants it. I think. Okay. Am I the only per I think I'm the only person that can even cast lightning damage spells. In this I think you too. are. Or oh, wait. What's know? lightning spoken? You what lightning spoken? Isn't guiding cast? bolt lightning? Or is that light? No, that's radiant. Oh, whoopsie. Sorry. No problem. Uh, um, Bunny, what would you like? The ring of protection. Ring of protect. You are now protect. Protect. And so then do so I nice. get the gloves? Yes. That, Piggly, okay, unless cool, you cool. wanted them. No, no, no. I'll take Piggly it. has okay. the sword. Piggly has the vicious longsword. All right. Uh, Eternograx is mighty surprised at the gifts that you've been at the, as the, your, uh, as your magic items transform into these ridiculous weapons. Um, he particularly notes the, 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 the lightning rod and the big fucking sword. Um, <laughs> Uh, he turns to you, uh, he, to you two the, that are wielding them. He says, "Those are godly items. Wield them with pride. They don't show often, but when they do, oh, no, I'll make sure it gets good use. You just get double damage on every attack." It's like, it's like, it's like, it's like hell yeah, dude. We're gonna fuck shit up. And he holds a fist, like a, he's offering you a fist bump. <laughs> oh, I happily take it. Um, friendship. Yay! <laughs> Let's break shit. Oh no! <laughs> I'd um, like to see what industry is gonna do about this. <laughs> oh god! Do we know who we're fighting? <laughs> I'm sorry. I mean, I'm just, I'm just sorry I'm, that I'm you just, should I'm mention Industria. There's a reason he hasn't lost a tournament in a while. It's because he knows how to raise them. And more importantly, he double seeds. Those miscreants you saw in the championship in the earlier rounds, well, they uh, they lost in round two. But he has sent another champion. He always Question. Sends two. Sorry, yes. I'm sorry. Question for you. Um, being a former champion of his, do I have any idea? Do you know of anyone named Jaquin? Oh. Interesting. We're going up against Sundula him. bitch! By your face, I'm assuming you do. What do you know about them? Um... He's kind, he's kind of like the only parent figure I have in my life whom I love and trust. Oh, we're gonna kill him. He's the little rat that ran away! Don't worry. Combat Wait, I think you're thinking of somebody sword. else, Dorg. Wait, who are we thinking? Who is the dude around? I think you might be. I think you might be thinking of Desmond. Or Desmond, yeah. Des oh, Desmond, yeah. Never mind. I'm an idiot. <sighs> Look, everyone coming here knows it's for sport. If you die, you are sent back to your body. 
Yeah, I'm aware. Jaquin. Sorry, that was sassy. I didn't mean to be sassy. I'm distressed right now. Jaquin will die, and that is fine. He, they will be fine. But I see what do uh, 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 this is me as a player. What does Helmsworth know about Jaquin? Uh, you know that they are a sort of advisor in all churchly duties uh, regarding the happenings of Akensha. Hmm. Wait, what was my what was my relationship with Jaquin again? You know them. They're a little bit of a liaison of sorts for Akensha's foreign affairs. They may okay. have they may have they may have they may have reached out to you before. A Turner Grax turns to you and says, I'll let you know that this fight will be over in an instant. They're not particularly thick. They don't have a lot of they they don't they are they didn't they're not very withstanding well standing to physical trials, but they are incredibly powerful with their spells. And more importantly, I don't think that they're they use spells not in the traditional spell books. They use magic beyond my reckoning. Beyond your reckoning? I Aren't you old as hell? Magic. Industria creates new magic every single day, as do all, all gods here. I have my own spells, which, if you please me, perchance, you may just get a few of them. Well, get ready to pay out. E get ready to pay out, Eternal Grax. Because winning's my thing. I like... <laughs> Helmsworth, I don't mean to cut your tide short, but dying is usually your thing, and I will not <laughs> as such. But I'm still here, though. Yeah, but he bounces back. He does. True. He's really, really good at not dying when he's it's, supposed to. It's actually to. quite impressive. Mm. Well, once you're ready to fight them, let me know. Do question as player... Is there anything I can roll for to like remember the magic he's using or like any sort of like his play style? Like I'm assuming like he brought me up in the cleric traditions. So, like he, I would know like what's up. Uh, by the way, to those wondering Jay Quinn's pronouns, they are he, they, uh, for chance. I see there's some pronoun discourse in chat, just so you all know. Uh, uh, but uh, yes, uh, you know a little bit about, about industria magic having been a cleric and whatnot. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um, you are very much aware that um, Industria magic is very explosive. Um, it's very fast. It does a lot of da it does a lot of damage, um, but it is also very good at buffing. Um, it will help boost. Uh, it, it is it, if if it, uh, uh, an Industria cleric in a party can be quite useful at keeping people's pace up, allowing people to stay healthy. Um, life domain clerics are part of the Industria canon, um, as well as some other more nasty clerics. So it, this is going to be a very quick fight. If you guys can get in and overwhelm them, you will you will win. But if they can set up, they you you will die. So and all of you all of you have met. Uh, Jay Quinn, you got y'all met y'all met them at the docks. Uh, okay, I couldn't up. remember if that was Jay Quinn. Yes, <laughs> I realized there's some yeah, confusion yeah. amongst my players. It was a long time ago. It was, it was episode one. <laughs> that was way was back episode in one. episode one. Wow, we're at episode one. Wow, wow, man, remember episode now. one? How far? How far we've come? Mm -hmm. So, uh, so uh, Eternagrax lets you let you all know this about about Jaquin and he turns to you and says good luck uh, if I know Industria he trains his he trains his clerics well and he Turner Grax leaves well y'all want a godly shit and <laughs> <laughs> Well, like, well, I guess I guess we're taking him out. I mean, no hard feelings or anything. Yeah, shame. Ugh, his face looked a lot better before we break it. Oh, we don't have to. It's we just a dream. Do. Right, right. He'll be fine. 
Besides, <laughs> when we kill him, he'll just go back to his real body. Also, he won't remember any of it. Remember? So, like, he won't even know. He won't remember? Yeah. Remember? That's what Eternagrach said at the very beginning. If we <laughs> went down, we would forget everything and we just wake up. So, oh, like, okay, if we take okay. if we take him out, he's not gonna remember. It, so, I mean, I don't, I don't, not believe Industry won't say anything. He'll be like, and those evil people did this to you, including these very specific names and places. Do you think that Jet Quinn's gonna believe that? You said you were close. Yeah, but it's. I don't think he'd be too proud of me leaving the domain. I feel, told him like that he, I feel like I feel like I feel like he'd want you to do your best regardless of what you're doing, right? <laughs> yeah, maybe. Um, I mean, he did. He certainly he certainly sent you to do this. It certainly wasn't in Industria's best wishes. So I mean, we can think about that later. Existential stuff later. Fight now. <laughs> I mean, fight in like how many hours? Y'all got three oh. hours. Oh, <laughs> I will allow you guys to spend this how you want. You can watch. Uh, you can watch some of the exhibition matches for for a second and third for a third and fourth place. Um, uh, uh, there's some other just there's some games you all can play some carnival style games. Uh, <laughs> carnival games. Carnival Let's do games it. for Let's gods though. Keep that in mind. The, these are not easy DCs. Are are there any that are like like uh, gambling based? Ring toss. <laughs> is there one where me and Dork can just hit a hammer? <laughs> the <is> a <laughs> uh, keep in mind, I still have exhaustion. I think uh, uh, your exhaustion has worn off. Yeah. Okay, then I'm good to do whatever. Oh, yeah. let's. Can I find Jaquin? Can I find? Him? Uh, you can potentially go and try and find Jaquin. Um, and I want to eat some funnel cakes. <laughs> Bunny says. <laughs> But, okay, Godly so, funnel cakes. Watch <laughs> Dorgan Pickley smash stuff. Okay. Yeah. Uh, help. I'm so I'm gonna say Helmsworth, uh, Marcus, uh, Helmsworth, Dorg, Pigley, and Bunny are gonna go to the go experience the the carnival and the celebration. Yeah. Okay. Definitely. Excellent. Uh, Helena is gonna go and and find uh, Jaquin. So yeah. you make uh we're, we're gonna go and deal with uh with uh the carnival stuff after Helms with after with Helena stuff okay, so Helena goes uh she she walks out of the of the locker room as the the rest of the crew goes to party and and live it up in in essentially paradise, um and she makes her way to the Industria locker room. <clears throat> uh, you get to the locker room. Make a stealth check for me, please. <laughs> Oh, Thank no. God, I'm not there. <laughs> the thing I have a disadvantage on. You have disadvantage on stealth. Yeah, because I've chain mail on thirteen. Ah. Uh, uh, as you get close, uh, Indus you hear Industria's voice say, "It seems as though we have a visitor," and he walks out. out in, as he walks out of the locker room and he stares you down. Helena, why don't you come in? Sounds great. Thank you. Mm. And he ushers you. He lets you walk in first, and he ushers you inside. So and there, there's Jaquim, the familiar black, uh, charcoal black skinned tiefling with uh, with with horns, curly hair, and they turn to you. Uh, oh, Helena! Hi. It's been so Is long. It, it feels know. like it's been barely two weeks. I know. That's wild how time works. Um, can I give you a hug? Of course. Yay! And give him a hug. Uh, they hug. They give you a nice big hug back. Industria turns to you and says, "All right, break it up, break it up." So, Helena, I was just discussing with Jake when how you left the faith. Do oh, you, you kind of kicked me out. Uh, kicking you out is a is a word that we don't like to use. Um, you literally went. Never mind. Snap. Boom. Like Thanos, does that exist here? I don't. I've also never seen the movie. <laughs> <laughs> yes, the, M the MCU is now also canon. <laughs> Stop canonizing things. Uh, uh, Industria turns to you and says, "I like to think it is more. I was given a profound amount of disrespect, and I politely forced you to leave before you embarrassed yourself further." Jaquin kind of looks like an awkward kid. Just like watching his parents fight, fight <laughs> this whole situation. 
But it's okay. I understand. Children rebel. As they do. Does that mean you expect me to come back to you? I don't know. Who's your god now? <gasps> you still haven't given me your three guesses. Oh, do I do I have to guess? Yes, of course, it's fun. May I use any? No. <laughs> Jay Quinn, who do you suppose Helena's new god is? Jay Quinn kind of just awkwardly turns to you. And said, uh, he, uh, he, he, they, they lean in and say, Helena, just, mm. just tell him it will be easier. You don't want him to find out on his own. Why? This makes no sense. Why do you care who I work for now, Industria? You're just curious, you want to meddle, I get it, meddle like metal. <laughs> <laughs> I am curious <laughs> if perhaps you're working with one of my old business partners. Would I know if that's the connection? No. Oh my God, who are your old business partners? Do I get three guesses? Industry has a lot of business partners. It's true. <sighs> who do you like? Who's like your least favorite? There's a few. Hmm. Off the top of your head. I'm going to guess now, and I'm mm -hmm. going to figure this out by probing your mm -hmm. mind. And there's nothing. Oh no, you're not. It. No, are you? We said no. <laughs> Thoughts, wisdom saving. Oh, uh, oh yeah, I'm so good at those. Um, natural twenty plus ten equals thirty. <laughs> Pretty good. I will take a photo if you don't Pretty believe it. Pretty good. That's really good. It's a shame the DC is a uh, higher. Because he's a god. Ooh. He is a god. Uh, nice. He is a god. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he goes, my, oh, my, Rebellion Ox. I haven't seen that name in ages. Well, since the Industrial Revolution. <laughs> Revolution, rebellion, same thing. Oh yeah, are you see you the jokes? I've still got it. You still got it. Does he still have it? Oh, they still have it. Oh wow, wow, Jay Quinn. You don't suppose that this little usurper plans to overthrow me, do you? Usurper? Oh my god. Interesting. What? If that is your plan, I will have you know I will kill you. Oh. Exciting. I thought Carnegie was gonna um, take my like skin me and then use my skin to lay out the new. I just I have to keep your plan straight. So like I just need to know what's coming. You know what I mean? If you keep running, the Carnegie plan will follow through. Ah, uh, okay. If you try to usurp me, I will kill you by my own hand. Right. Okay. That checks out. Mm -hmm. I love that. Um. Do you mind if I have some privacy with Jay Quinn? Go for it. Thank you. And he step and Industria steps out of the room. Uh, Jacqueline just turns to you and says, I told you'd be less awkward if you just told I, me. I, I do, you do think I listen to anyone but myself? I know, I know, I understand. Uh, um, so what, what are you doing here? I am a champion of Industria. Yeah. And I plan on winning the tournament. Why do you want to win? Well, I was brought here. I see no reason to lose. You know, I don't want to fight you. That's not really in my wheelhouse. He, uh, they place their hand on, on your hand and they say, Helena, no hard feelings. This isn't about our relationship or our friendship. Helena, I still see you as somewhat of my daughter. And if you defeat me today, why I would be Oh, so very proud. Oh, that makes you feel better. Follow-up question. Thank you. Um, how do you feel about me working for Rebellion Ox now? I honest, say, honest. I can't say I'm excited about what that means. In my theorizing with the old gods and what I've studied, they always work for themselves. You know, Industria killed someone to get to where he is, right? 
Because I learned that the hard way. Industria was a new concept. And the furthering of the pre-existing concepts of fire. It was necessary. Stealing it was... in industry from... And replacing it with rebellion is dangerous. I'm curious is all. Be careful. Whatever you do, you are a very special person, and I'm sure it is for the best. But I can't necessarily say that I agree with it. I trust your judgment. Mm. I raised you right. I know whatever you choose to do, it is right. Yes. Thank you. Weird question. Um, was it you who told Kongi? I was on the island. He got the information from me. I didn't tell him. Can I insight that? Go for it. <laughs> Don't know if that's how words work. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, 28. You I'm note a now. particular tinge of sadness at his words, almost as if the information was not given voluntarily. The information right. was taken from him through magical right. or physical means. Right. Uh, can I can I give you another hug? Oh, always. Okay, and I give him a hug. I give him a hug, and I'll say, um, like in their ear, like, "Don't go easy on me, all right?" I wasn't planning on it. I've got yeah. a reputation to uphold. Oh, I'm sure you do. <laughs> um, don't forget to stretch either. Make sure you drink lots of water and um, cast sending to me sometime. If you, you know, I'll cast sending don't to you too. Help I him. I, I no, but like, just like, I said, no. <laughs> I'll, I'll be sure to cast sending sometime. Though I hope you haven't been casting that on the island too much. I, I noticed you tried to connect with me one time, but it didn't get through. Why shouldn't I cast it on the island? <laughs> Not saying that I did, but like, it just hypothetically, if I did, what would that do? Helena, please tell me you did not cast it on the island. <laughs> Helena, don't make me lie for you again. Twice. Don't cast it a third time. Why? Especially not to Carnegie. Why? Why? Because then Carnegie can find you. You know I have scrying. You know I can find you wherever you are. Oh, uh, this is the most Helena thing to ever happen, honestly. This is so Helena. Um, you, you, you cast sending to Carnegie? Oh, twice! We had a con- three times! Sorry, three times. <laughs> oh, no, we missed three times! You watch, as, Hel times. You watch as Jaquin just- <laughs> After all that work. I'm so sorry. I didn't know you. I'm sorry. It's been a really long week. I died. Did you see me die out there? I I saw death. Um, I changed domains. I watched people die. It's been a rough two weeks. It's, uh... Helena, <laughs> I'm on that boat, on the way to the island. They are going to make me cast scrying to find you, and I'm going to have to lie about what I see. And um, you, I'm going to have to hope that they don't have someone else check what I'm saying. Okay. I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Everything's so fine. Um, it's not I'm, fine, Helena. No, it's so fine. Helena, you know, I, you always, are... I always figure things out. <laughs> um, I'll just, I'll just. It's time for you to deal with the circumstances that you have created for yourself. It is not fine. There was a problem. You must address it. Yeah. Um. Yeah, okay. Um, I have new information. You need to warm up. I can tell you haven't stretched those cars. Helena, um, you and... better win this fight. I can't remember this conversation. I can't go easy. Oh, right. And if I don't remember it, yikes. Um, you must bye. win. I'll try go prepare. Best. Okay, bye. Love you, bye. Bye. You I... no Jake <laughs> looks noticeably flustered. Industria is just leaning against the wall. How'd it go? I went so well. Good. Have fun. Mm, thank you. And can I, can I give you a kiss on the cheek? No. Bye. Okay. 
He Bye. goes back in the locker room. Mm. Helmsworth, Dork, Bunny, Piggly. Yeah. Spring break. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, so, Dork and uh, Piggly, you wanted to play Big Hammer game. Yeah, I do yeah. also have like a question about the general carnival and celebrations. Mm -hmm. Are the are the gods like among the carnival? Are they hanging out? No, they're not hanging out for the most part. It, it, <clears throat> and the only reason Industrial and Eternograx are there is because they're just trained. They were there to coach you guys. Okay. The other ones, they, there might be a few hanging around. It, you, if you want, do you want to look for anyone in specific? I would be looking for Terra. Uh, you can look around. Um, you can look around, but it, for the most part, he probably won't be here anymore. Okay. Okay. But, uh, so, Bunny, you quickly find some godly funnel cake for yourself. Um, it restore. it gives you five temporary hit points, and you, as you eat it throughout this, it tastes great. Cinnamon, it's crunchy, it's got ice cream on it, it's so good. Munch! Munch! Bunny Munch. says. Uh, Dorg, Piggly, uh... Uh, y'all uh, want to play Big Hammer game? Of yeah. course. All right, Big Hammer game. So you'll each be taking. So, uh, Dork, I need you to make an athletics check to lift up Big Hammer. All right. Ah. Ooh yeah. Uh, what's <laughs> what? What's your roll? Was that a nat twenty? So, no, it was a nineteen. So, uh, you, so twenty six. All right. So you rock up to this thing. You notice that this isn't your typical game. This is a game that's usually played by it seems like giants. Um, the, the bell is so much higher. The hammer is made entirely out of stone. It, 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 it this is going to be a hard one, but you grab a handle, you lift it up with all your strength. It is easily a lopsided, like it is, it is, it is so goddamn heavy, but you lift it and now athletics check to roll to hit, please. 25. You. Ah! And you just slam the hammer down on the on the pad, and everyone looks at this at you, a tiny little human person, um, and you absolutely crush it. And the the the, the little thing goes, Doom! and it shoots all the way up, three stories straight up, and then you hit the bell, <laughs> and this giant beside you gives you a massive stuffed bunny. Like a rabbit creature. Not like Bunny Bunny, but a rabbit. <sighs> like a cartoon rabbit. Ferocious cheering from Bunny with her mouth full. Food's flying <laughs> everywhere. Ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've collected so many trophies in my time. Uh, this might be my favorite. It's six feet tall. It's pretty, it's quite large. Piggly. So like, is, if, you, if you need help, it's two door inches size. shorter Two inches taller than me, but you need four that. inches taller than you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, Bigly, uh, would you like to also play Hammer Game? Of course. All right, Ralph. Uh, Ralph, would you like to play a game? <laughs> <laughs> ah, my headphones. Uh, you are now. Okay. Wait for his headphones to get back on. Okay, you are now wolf moded up. Uh, uh, the onlookers are like, what the hell? Why is this man a wolf? <laughs> who is this gremlin? Yeah, who is this, who is this little gremlin man's? Uh, I, so, is, athletics check to lift the hammer? Mm hmm. Uh, 22. All right, it's a, nice. you, you're a little shorter than Dork, so it's a little bit more awkward, but you still lift it, lift it quite easily. You're like, yeah, okay, it's up. Now you got to make an athletics check to hit. Okay. Keep in mind, uh, this thing I'm going to use my magic pants to go 30 feet up in the air and then slam down. All righty. <laughs> so you nice. were going to swing at disadvantage because you are shorter than the thing. But now you are, this will get, this will negate the disadvantage. So and then I have it. advantage because wolf. Yes. <laughs> nice. Oh, still bad. I'm a real chat guy. <laughs> oh, boy. Yeah, 16. 16. The best. As you, you, you did all you could to get that, to get the swing to line up, but... You know you're you're not quite used to the, this the, the heft of this thing. It uh, kind of overthrows your momentum, 
So as you bring it down, and you miss the the peak of your swing, and you kind of just like bonk, and it's a commendable swing for a human, uh, but uh, it's not quite to the godly status that these people are used to, and it just it goes up two stories, and everyone's like whoa, but it's it's there there's like a few like <laughs> chuckles uh, around as they uh, as as people watch on. Uh, the, the car, the carny man comes over and says, it's going to be a gold from each of, uh, a gold from each of you to play. If you want to play again, it's a gold piece. Bigly, what I'll do you only, think? I'll just play once. We got the big bunny, right? We did get the big bunny. We're good. That's all that matters. Here you go. Uh, Helmsworth, where are you gambling? I'd what like to tip to... him an extra gold, by the way. I mean, I it have a, it. I have a, I have a little, I have a little passive that allows me to suss out the best places for me to gamble. So. Okay, so your your little passive feature is like, uh, is uh, it's going off. It says the during charts. involving games of chance or figuring odds on the best play, you can get a solid sense of which choice is likely the best and which opportunities seem too good to be true at the end's discretion, of course. So the only games that would guarantee success are the ones that are like skill checks, like the hammer game or reaction tests. But everything around you otherwise is ab an absolute crapshoot. Um, it doesn't seem like there's anything that would be that would be catered to your more charisma-style charisma uh, skill set. Um, with based around lying and ga and poker and whatnot. However, there is a game that does catch your fancy, um, and that is the ring toss. The ring toss game allows there there are a hundred total bottles before you. You can purchase five rings for a gold. All right. Uh, can I do an investigation on this thing to see what it's all about? So, up against. Uh, roll investigation, please. Um, you know what? I'll, I'll, I'll use my chat dice. Uh, yeah. Ooh, nice. Uh, so that's going to be... Uh, 21. 21? Okay, so you suss this thing out and you notice that this is a pure game of chance. The rings are the perfect size to go over the tops of the bottles. Um, and you note that uh, throwing them one at a time is the least optimal way to succeed on this. That it is best to chuck as many little loops as possible over top of these bottles to, to better benefit your odds. Uh, is there any, actually, is magic allowed at these things? Uh, there are magical countermeasures. Otherwise they would be getting fleeced every day. Yeah. I'm just like, what are the magical countermeasures? You don't know. <laughs> oh, can I, can I find out? No. <laughs> you have detect magic. <laughs> um, wait, do I? Um... I have identify. Uh, not in this case. It's a, this is a little outside of your. Of they your are pay. rings and bottles. Yeah, rings and <laughs> bottles. Okay. Uh, I mean, I'll do whatever gives me the best odds. I guess the best odds would be, and I'll tell you this, is buying uh two hundred rings. So that would be. Well, that would be 40 gold. You would get 200 rings. You have a good chance of a ring landing on a bottle. I mean, that's just spending up to that much, right? I, how many rings can I throw at once? You can throw a whole bucket of rings at once. You can throw as many at once as you'd like. Okay, how many rings are in a bucket? It's, <laughs> uh, how many are you planning on buying? How much gold do you have? <laughs> I have 361 gold. You can buy uh 500 gold in a bucket. 500 rings in a bucket. Oh, okay. Uh then in that case, I'll do the the I'll do the 40 one then. All right. So this is going to be a roll on the Offbeat Outlaw Discord because 
how how this works, how I've decided this works, is each one has a D100 chance with a 1 in 100 chance of landing. And if he wins, he gets something really good. And I told him how to win this game. <laughs> which will bring up his odds to better. Uh, here we go. Roll them bones. Uh, how many of these did you buy? 200? Uh, I got, yeah, I got 200. So I, I can win more than once, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, potentially. <laughs> I mean, you'll run out of gold, but... I think you're, you're going to want to put a... Yeah, I'm going to want to put a thing there. Hopefully it can roll this many. Yes, it can. And you have... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven... Seven wins! Dang! Dang, nice. Killed it. Congratulations, you have seven wins, which nets you a total of seven empty charge stones, which can be fitted with any spell that you would like. Dang. Yeah. Neat. Um, that was worth it. Man. Uh, so seven. Wait, which types of charge stones? Are these malleable charge stones or fixed? Uh, these would be malleables, but you can make them fixed with the proper jeweler, with a jeweler. Yep. Okay. Yep, yep. Seven. Uh, for for stones. reference, charge stones are a homebrew item which allows you to put spells into magic rocks. Malleable ones, as in empty malleables, can be, can be used like spell storing rings in which you can put the spells in there. Fixed ones recharge on their own. Math. <laughs> Anyway, with the party now with new items, uh, Bunny fueled up on... Hey, how, does how does concentration work with these again? Uh, I'll explain it to it after the stream. It's okay. Uh, but but uh, I'm going to... Oh, gonna... I mean, because I, I did want to use... Because I do have, like, my own... Well, we'll, like, do, it, I... we'll, do, it, we'll do it after the stream. Uh, trust me. But with the, with the, oh, with the okay. party coming to a close on this day, uh, Bunny fueled up on Funnel Cake... Uh, Marcus yeah. and Piggly proud of their winnings of the six foot tall cartoon rabbit and Helena feeling bleak considering she has to fight her old master who is a resident badass cleric. The party gets ready for their next match. And that is where we shall end it for today's stream. Thank you all so much for watching. Uh, this has been 7C's Six Idiots. Don't go anywhere. We're going to be raiding one of our friends after this. Um, and uh, so listen to all of us plug uh, whatever that is that we are plugging. To start, as usual, Liz, what are we plugging today? Yeah. Oh, happy International Women's Day, everyone. Yay! Yay. Um, Women all around the world, and not just cisgendered women, are um, absolutely incredible and are fighting for rights, places, recognition in a variety of fields, policies, workspaces, and institutions. Women are incredible, and I want to celebrate that. And today, I'm going to celebrate my fellow in this game, Caroline. Caroline's infinite talent is awe-inspiring, absolutely, truly. I think we all know this, um, but getting to know Caroline off stream, it has been the utmost pleasure to experience her kindness, humor, and insights. So talking, taking too much of your time, Caroline is someone who truly um, and someone I'm blessed to call a friend. And so I want to wish a very happy International Women's Day to Caroline and to everyone in chat. Mm -hmm. So yeah. show some appreciation for the women in your lives and the women around the world. Uh, and now let's let's go show appreciation for Perfect Bunny. She gets to plug next. Plug, plug what you want to plug. So Bunny. Uh <laughs> um, hi guys. <laughs> um Caroline is on TikTok at, at Caroline Smash and also on Instagram as at Caroline Smash. Mm -hmm. So follow her. Why aren't you doing that right now? Why why not, you fools? Uh you damnable fools. <laughs> uh we shall now slide this over to Marcus Territory. Yes, guys, I have been I have Marcus Territory. I've been Dorg the Half Fork Seat Half Fork Paladin. You can find me on TikTok at Marcus Territory, same for Instagram and OnlyFans, and on my website at MarcusTerritory.ca. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> sliding it over to Mash Budson. Hello, I'm Mash Budson on TikTok, Instagram, and YouTube. Ballard, go ahead. I'm, I'm, I'm Ballard Boy. I'm on the <laughs> Offbeat Outlaw <laughs> Discord. Um, I also have a playlist on YouTube for all you people who want to have a little bit, know a little bit more about Helmsworth. I have a playlist called Helmsworth's Jukebox 
I update it every week. It's got new songs and they all pertain to either his character or his backstory. So it's up to you to figure it out. But I put them there because I like I like messing with all of you. And I like giving you <laughs> little bones. <laughs> I swallowed water in my lungs. <laughs> because I am apparently <clears throat> 22 years old and completely unable to breathe. <clears throat> anyway... Are you okay? That's usually my thing. Uh, yeah, I'm fine. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just good. I'm, okay. I'm just, I'm just very, very smart. Anyway, this has been Seven C Six Days. I am Upbeat Outlaw. You can follow me on Upbeat Outlaw, and I'd love to see all of you on Longshot RPG this Thursday, where you can watch me play as the Forever DM uh, character that I made, who is ridiculously powerful and annoys the crap out of my dungeon master. Anyway, that's all I wanted. Really wanted to plug, but. We're not gonna raid! Yeah, raid. Who are we raiding? Raid! raid. Oh, that's a good question. Yeah. Who are raid we? Shadow Legends. There. Just kidding, not them. Uh, we're raiding <laughs> Dice Cream Sandwich. Uh, another Canadian streamer wh uh, who also is doing D&D. &D. Uh, so please go and show them some love. They are having a good time tonight. Uh, and Baba Booey, three, two, one, let's go raid! Get in there, guys. Yay, Get in guys. there. Get in there. Get in that raid. Is, is the raid oh, yeah. Get in there. Get in there. It's not the raid. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Get Wait in there. Minute. Get in there. Get in there. Raid, it, raid is working. I see it. It's oh, working. you see it? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> uh, everybody. Everybody get in there. Come on. Uh, I don't. I, come on. You got I can't more send good, the raid. More here than that. You can't send it? Yes. It didn't work. I, I see it. The time's it still going down raining. for us. Uh, we'll just stay in there. It'll go when it happens, I guess. Somebody <laughs> once, once told, told me the world, the world was gonna, gonna roll me. me. I, I ain't the, the sharpest, sharpest tool in the, the shed. <laughs> she was looking the kind of the thumb in her finger, finger and her thumb in the shape of a nail on her forehead. Start coming and they don't stop coming. Fed to the rules and I hit the ground running. Didn't make sense not to live for fun. The brain gets smarter and it gets dumb. So much to do. Oh, I was going for it. You were doing really well. Uh, okay, that's it. For those, if you're, if y'all are still here, in case the stream didn't exactly end. Bye.